Okay, and the upcoming Jaw of the Dragon. So, uh, that's right. It's time to play some more games. It's been a, it's been a while since I streamed. Uh, I've been busy. Like, I took the week off to play Zelda. And uh, for the past two days, I've um, I've done nothing but play it. I, I finished Jaw of the Dragon a couple of days ago and didn't formally announce it because... <laughs> Because I was so busy playing the game. Terrible timing to finish a book. Um, honestly, like, I was putting off Zelda for a while while I was uh, getting the finishing touches done on it. But now that it's done, it's uh, good to go. And of course, like, I've been aching to play some DKC, so... Yeah, I'm getting ready to... Uh, I'm almost at the point where I'm getting ready to play some other games again. Um, Tears of the Kingdom has been great, but... Um, yeah, I feel as if... Um, I don't know, I... I really do feel I'm at that point now where I'm not necessarily like, getting fired up for new releases. And that's true for... <laughs> <laughs> and that's true for quite a few of them. Oh, hey, did I move my phone out? I've been, um, I don't know, I, I have been thinking playing uh, Tears of the Kingdom that, like, it's a great game, and it's gonna go down as, like, one of the best of all time, but, like, I, uh, I really can't, like, stop appreciating, uh, the older stuff. So, in, in a lot of ways, I'm not sure if anything's ever gonna really replace the original Donkey Kong Country for me. Mario World, The Link to the Past, Ocarina. I don't know, I think tonight we might actually just uh, spend quite a bit of time playing some of this older stuff. I don't know, I feel like I'm almost done with Tears of the Kingdom. I, I don't know how long it is. I feel like I put so much time into it. And I, I don't know exactly how much longer we can expect it to last. I'm wearing a Donkey Kong Country shirt, by the way, <laughs> which has been awesome. I I really love it. I just ordered my uh, another Zelda shirt too. So. Got it. I love how every time I play this game, like I'm always like right before Poison Pond. Like it's the only level that I like remotely tend to get like filtered by at this point. It's not even that hard. It's just ugh, I just don't enjoy it. Yeah, it's not doing very well. I uh, just finished a book. And I'm not even excited for that. Like, I, I've been so busy. Like, I can't... So many great things have been happening over the past couple of weeks that, like, I can't even, like, process them all with, like, the book getting finished and Tears of the Kingdom being great and just, like, you know, like, you know, uh, other things. I don't know. I, I feel like... Hmm. Yeah, life's going well for me in general. I mean, in general. Of, of course, there are certain things that... Uh, need to be fixed. Well, that won't ever be fixed. But, uh, I don't know. I, I've been thinking about that a lot. Like, I, I... I've been doing so well, like, personally, but there are people in my life right now that are, uh, having a really rough time, and I, I'm having trouble, like, really feeling happy myself when I know people who are just, like, really... really struggling. I, I don't know. I just feel guilty. Yeah, I've been having, like, weird, like, depression spells. I think because of, like, the lack of exercise I've been getting because of, like, working so much. Like, I feel great now because I've eaten and, like, I, I just, like, did some weightlifting and stuff. But for the most part, I just, I don't know, there's just, there's been these really weird moments these past couple of days where I've just been, like, lying in bed doing nothing. And I just don't know what's causing it. Usually right after I eat. Uh, oopsie goes. 
don't know. I think I'm going to try, like, exercising more. And, like, the reason I haven't been exercising is just because of, like, just the sheer amount of things I've been trying to do. Like, um... I don't know. Like, I've put off, like, working out because... Because I need to get Draw the dra Dragon done, like, a long time ago. Fuck! Every time! Why do I do that every single time? I don't know. Now, now that it's done, I'm, um... I'm starting... I'm starting to... I don't know. I started working out again, so... Hopefully, I can start, like, doing it, like, every other day. Or whatever. Actually, like, I'd, I'd like to work out every day, honestly. Like, I have this every other day crap. Like, every day. But I don't know. I think the only time... Only reason I managed to do it today was because I wasn't working. I don't know. I, I'm really struggling, like... Getting all of that together. Like... Here we go. Now, was I talking about something else? Like, I feel like I'm going on a lot of tangents. My mind's like all over the place right now. Oh, thank you. Burnout? I don't know, probably. Yeah, I d there are definitely times where I just, like, sit around and do nothing. And I just feel so guilty whenever it happens. Like, I'm not even talking about, like, playing video games. Because, like, I think video games are, are very important to me. Um, I mean, like, literally nothing. Like, can't watch TV, can't do anything. Like, maybe I'll listen to an audiobook. Maybe. weird coming back and playing these Super Nintendo games again. After playing something like Tears of the Kingdom, like, damn. Like, it, it really does feel like... I don't know, I really wonder if, like, a big reason I'm into, like, Ocarina of Time so much this playthrough is because uh... It's just, like, classic Zelda. Like, I really do feel as if, uh, classic Zelda will get, like, more appreciated with, uh, with the advent of open world Zelda. Because, like, when Classic Zelda was, a, was like, at its peak, like, so many people were, like, negatively comparing it to other games. Like, Ocarina, of course, had, like, the, uh, the Final Fantasy VII thing, and, uh, you know, Twilight Princess had, like, other AAA games at the time. Like, it's weird thinking back on, like, how popular Twilight Princess was, and then, like, realizing that at the time it was, like, heavily downplayed in favor of like, other AAA games. Um... You have, like, Skyward Sword and, like, the Skyrim and Dark Souls thing. Like, even now, you still have, like, people saying Tears of the Kingdom can't compete with, like, Elden Ring and uh, Red, Dead Red Dead Redemption 2, which is laughable. I was actually, like, considering making a video, like, talking shit about Godwinson. Uh, I do think... Um, I probably would have done it if I had time today. Well, I, I did have time. I just didn't do it. All right, here we go. The pet cricket? Um, no. I don't know how it's survived so long. I mean, I, I don't know anything about crickets, but it's gotten in my house, and I don't know where it is. I got the frog that I found out of the house, but, like, the cricket, I can't. It seems like it's staying in the same spot. Like, I don't... I don't... How long was I working on it? Uh, it started production in January 2022. If I remember correctly. So it was about like uh, a year and four months. It should have been done in like within a year, but like I delayed it to, to make sure it wasn't rushed. And even now it still kind of feels rushed. Like even now, like I, I read through it and like edited it and like went through it again. And I'm just like, eh, do I, am I sure I want to release it now? I feel like if I don't release it now, it's going to have taken too long. So I, I think I am just going to release it now. I mean, it's it just, like, I only feel apprehensive about it because 
you know, I, I want, like, my books to be good. And, um, uh, I don't know. Like, a part of me is never happy with, like, anything I do. So, like, I read, like, Eye of the Dragon, and I, I notice all these problems. Cruel and Beautiful, Rather Hole, Lord Frey, and now John. Like, it's all the same. Like, I'm all just, I'm always just like, oh, this could have been better. I could have taken more time with it, but, like, you have to, like, release it. Like, if you take, like, too long with these projects, like, it's just going to, like, just weigh on you, and, like, you're never going to be happy with it ever. I feel like. So, I, I think, like, at this point, like, I did everything I wanted to do with Jaw of the Dragon. Like, I really did. Like, it was conceptualized to be, like, this straightforward and this, like, uh... And that simplistic, so I, I don't think... I don't know, it, it just... Yeah, that, that's the first time I've ever seen, like, Godwin's... I, I, I saw him praise, like, Tropical Freeze a while back, so I thought... I had the impression he was based, actually. But, like, seeing, like, the Tears of the Kingdom takes, I was just like... Is he being serious? Is he doing a bit? Because this is, like... This is, like, awful. It's legit, like, retarded, the shit he was spouting. Like, he was, like, trying to say that, like, it looks like a dream... Tears of the Kingdom looked like a Dreamcast game. <laughs> and then it takes, like, five minutes for, like the world to load when you drop from the sky, which is, like, completely wrong. Like, he didn't even mention, like, the, the underground at all. Like, I, I legit got the impression that not only did he not play the game, he didn't even, like, know anything about it. Like, that's how bad it was. <laughs> like, oh, there's nothing new to this game. Yeah, sure, bro. Sure. $70 DLC. Like, he's unironically still calling it, like, a $70 DLC. Like, most people are not doing that, because most people, like, who have played both Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom, no. I mean, Godwinson seems to be this kind of person who shit on Breath of the Wild as well, so I really shouldn't be surprised, but yeah, I, I, I'm upset. Like, I, uh, I'm not happy with that. That's just, that's just fucking stupid. Yeah, more like his weight is catching up with him. Like, the fucker, the fucker doesn't work, and he's still, like, he still looks like a fucking landmass. Like, how is he that fat? Like, I don't know. I, I just, I don't feel sorry for PvP at all. Like, he has to be in worse shape than Ralph, right? Like, there's no way that, like, Ralph plays more than him. Like, no way. Will I ever make a book inspired by Killer7? Yeah, I have, uh, I have something planned. It's not anywhere near close to being, like, made, though. Uh... Yeah, it's, like, it, it's years off. I am so, like, I'm so loaded with projects right now. Stuff I need to get done first. It's, like, uh... It's definitely gonna happen at some point, but it's, like, uh, when is that gonna happen? Like, it took me four years to make Jaw of the Dragon. And, like, uh, in the end, it ended up being completely different than what it was originally claimed to be. I have uh, so, oops. Because it wasn't originally supposed to be, like, a No More Heroes knockoff, right? Like, it was supposed to be more like the original with, like, the, uh... It was supposed to be more like Eye of the Dragon with, like, all the characters and, like, the... The, the, the shonen battle manga style, like structure and stuff like that with all the, the action sequences um yeah i moved away from that because i felt when i finished eye of the dragon that like jack was like a terrible protagonist like i i hated jack and i still kind of do well actually not really i feel like towards the end i really managed to figure out what i wanted to do with the character but like yeah for a for a good portion of like uh, Eye of the Dragon, like, throughout all of Eye of the Dragon, and throughout a, a, a good chunk of, like, writing Jaw of the Dragon, I just hated Jack as a character, like, like, he was designed to be an audience surrogate character, uh, someone that was meant to introduce, like, the setting to people, like, someone who has, like, no idea about, like, 
uh, the world and how things work and stuff like that and has to have like a lot of things explained to him and, and things like that. It, it was meant to be like, again, like, you know, the type, right? Like I knew that like what I had done with the setting was going to be like kind of a hard sell to people. And so like Jack was, had to be designed around that, that idea instead like selling the setting of people instead of like being a character in his own right and i think the, i think the character really suffered because of that uh so jaw the dragon was like um retooled to be like focused entirely around jack because like originally it was supposed to supposed to be more about like sophie and like some of the some of the other like members of the order of the dragon uh belladonna in particular Belladonna in particular. <laughs> I, I feel so bad for Belladonna because, like, she was supposed to be, like, a major character in Draw the Dragon, but she got sidelined so hard that she's not even really a, a, ma a major character. It's it's so it's so sad. Poor Belladonna. She'll be she'll 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 be a she'll have a bigger role in uh, Heart of the Dragon. Don't worry. But um, yeah, it's like it's weird. She was like going to be one of the major main characters. I'll draw the dragon and she got shafted because of this. Uh, yeah, there was supposed to be like a lot of focus on characters like that, but like I, I decided to like retool it for um, the focus on Jack and develop him as a character. I really I like Sophie a lot more. Sophie um. Sophie is in Jaw of the Dragon for quite a lot of it. And I, I'm pretty happy with that character, too. Here we go. Oops. He was about to be Titus? Yes, exactly. Exactly. And I, I guess it's the same kind of problem. I don't I don't hate Titus personally, so I'm I'm kinda surprised I, I feel this way about my own character, but. Yeah, it's the it's the exact same thing, yeah. A lot of exposition, yeah. Yeah, hopefully like that uh hopefully by Heart of the Dragon the character will be uh leave more of an impact. I don't know, I'm anxious to like uh be done with him honestly. Um that is definitely one of the things I am definitely doing going forward is uh, I think I'm not going to write book series anymore. I'm just going to write with, like, one-offs. Like, I feel like writing book series is unnecessary. Like, the, the idea behind the Order of the Dragon trilogy initially was that it was supposed to be, like, uh, a series that would, like, evolve and grow, you know, like, and, and just expand. But I, I don't think that's really necessary considering like my business model and what i've been doing lately and how i like doing things like i like i like emphasizing like different characters and i like emphasizing like different aspects of the plot and stuff it's like i don't think i i like the idea of having like one main character like ever so i think so I think, like, after uh, The Heart of the Dragon is done, we're not going to have, like, a, a main guy for, for quite a while. Because... The way things are looking now, I'm not even sure, like, Jack will have that much of a, a presence in Heart of the Dragon either. I've been, like, outlining it, how it's going to go. It, it's a lot, it's a lot more like Eye of the Dragon, so, it, with, like, the, the different characters and stuff like that. So I think, like, what it's going to... go, got it. How do you do that thing where you like you skip the entire level? Like I've seen like speedrunners do it, but it's like you take like this 
you take one of these armadillos and you like have it hit you at like a specific angle or you like you hit it or something and it somehow triggers this thing where you just fly across the entire map it's so unbelievably cool and i would love to do it because I, I hate platform perils but, like this is one of those levels that did i did i put this as like one of the worst levels in the, in the game i think i did like i i just think this is a really underwhelming final level and the game is like so good too oh by the way uh <laughs> uh fuck greg males uh fuck the guy like at, at rare who like refuses to make banjo 3 like i i saw some tweets from him about like um so, some of the things he said like regarding like dkc and banjo kazooie and i just like laughed my ass off like how can you be that like fucking pathetic like really oh we want to make new original games we don't want to make endless sequels well why did you tease a sequel <laughs> the banjo 3 you fucking retard like that guy is still seething about like banjo kazooie nuts and bolts not being popular to this day like it is unbelievable how salty he is about that. I am talking about the right person, right? Greg Mills. Like, I I, uh, I don't follow Western creators for a reason, because they're all, like, whitey, whitey bitches, right? But, like, oof. Like, that guy is, like, really, really pissing me off. Like, what's with, like, these game creators just being pathetic people? Like, it's the same with, like, the, the Star Fox people who made, like, uh, you know, Star Fox 2 and stuff like that. Command, like... Why are they so terrible? Like, it's so weird. Like, they're so weirdly whiny about, like, the stuff they work on. Okay. I love how you just play this and just kind of chill. Actually updating uh, NSO in the next couple of weeks with uh, more Game Boy Advance games. Uh, Super Mario Advance, Super Mario Advance 3, and I think 2 as well. Yeah, yeah, it's like all three of the Mario Advance games that haven't come out yet. I don't know why they're doing them all at once. I would have preferred them like being a bit more spread out, but I don't know. Like, I'm curious how, how popular those games are going to be because they're basically just ports of games we already have, right? But I think, like, I personally will actually... I haven't beaten Super Mario Bros. 2 on Nintendo Switch Online yet. I, I think the Game Boy Advance version is actually my preferred version of the game. So, I am actually curious. Uh, if that's going to draw on any new fans or not. Like, uh, Super, Yoshi's Island is my favorite game of all time, so... I've actually never played the Game Boy Advance version, so I'm curious uh, if it holds up or not. I wish. My camera looks like it's far away. Ugh, okay. I think the light is too bright. Hang on, let me face with my lights. There we go. I love playing in the dark, but like you can't stream in it. Alright. Oops, hang on. Fuck. Yeah, I've been obsessed with uh, K. Rule lately because uh, they some guy like released that King King K. Rule animation, which I've been listening to like nonstop the past couple of days. It's it's so charming. So I've been obsessed with the character. <laughs> to us a thunder, <laughs> blood and thunder. Here we go. It's so good. How does it go? Like shit. It's such a good line. I I love that. I love that. I love that. It's I love that song. It's so good. 
Tip the scale. Alright, here we go. Yeah, I loved it so much. I started watching the uh, the old Donkey Kong Country cartoon, and it's really not bad. That that show is a lot of fun. I don't know why it was so hated. I guess at the time, like people were like wanted their cartoons to be super serious. I'm definitely gonna get uh, Tropical Freeze at some point on, on Switch. I, I really, I really should have gotten it a long time ago, but. I can't believe I lost Diddy, but okay. We did it. Alright, uh... It feels so weird not to sit through the credits, but I played through the game so often at this point that I, I really don't really feel the desire to do it. Okay, uh... Okay, we beat DKC. When, what's next? Mario World? Or... I think we're gonna do Mario World and Yoshi's Island tonight. Probably not a lot of it, but like, we'll, we'll play a couple of this. Oh, was anyone actually playing DKC? Weird. Okay. Yeah, I watched some Stutter and Craig play this game, and he's like legit really good at it. I was I was shocked. Like, I'm so used to like e celebs being garbage at games. Oh, I'm not sure if I call Craig an e celeb, but like, like it was weird watching him like someone who's actually like good, like play this stuff. Like, I'm not even sure- I'm not that good at Super Mario World. I'm, like, way better at DKC. Honestly, like, I don't like Mario World as much as DKC. Never have. I mean, I like the game a lot, obviously, but it's just... Um, typically when I compare the two, I, I, I like comparing DKC to Yoshi's Island, honestly. Like, I don't think Mario World can even come close to comparing. And plus, like, I have a tendency to, like, just cheat through all, like, the more difficult levels. Like, this is a really good example of what typically happens. Like, you're not supposed to be able to do that, because you're not supposed to know you can just do that kind of thing. But, I don't know, once you know, it becomes so easy. Just, ugh. I really wonder if they nerfed it in the in the Game Boy Advance port. It's a, it's a big reason why I'm very curious about it. Yeah, I played it back in the day, but I don't remember a whole lot about it. I don't- I never owned the game, so... Like, growing up, I always had this predisposition- uh, dis disposition to playing the, the original. It didn't make a whole lot of sense to me to play, like, ports. Like, I had, like, a bad experience. Like, I played, like, Super Mario 64 DS before I owned the... The actual N64 version, and, like, growing up, I really had this, like... I really felt like... I don't know, everybody knew the N64 version better than the DS version. So it was just, like, weird trying to talk about it and, like, the differences to other people. I don't know, it just felt like a completely different game. Like, I remember, like, getting into an argument once about with someone that I didn't know about, like, whether or not, like, Yoshi could breathe fire. <laughs> like, my my thinking was that, like, uh, 
Like, he can't just breathe fire. He has to, like, eat a, eat a fire flower. I don't know. Like, things like that were just weird. Like, arguing about stuff that, like, really doesn't matter. Here we go. Oops. Yeah, Yoshi's not even playable in, like, the original Super Mario 64, and yet he's, like, the character you start off as. Like, what a weird decision. Like, why would you do that? Like, let's make Mario 64. What do we do? Oh, we make Yoshi playable. Like, what? That's, that's so weird. Like, there's so many weird things about that game. Uh, I, I feel like people who don't, who didn't play it growing up, like, have no idea. Like, they really have no idea, like, about the mini games or about, like, uh, I really want that game to be re-released. Like, I have such fond memories of those, like, mini games and just, like, some of the stuff. Like, uh, I miss the DS era of Nintendo. Like, I really do. Like, it felt like it had a lot of soul that just, uh, I don't know, it hasn't really, I don't know, it's different now. For sure. And I mean, I, I guess even between like Mario World and Mario 64, there were a lot of changes. But now it's like, hmm. I hate to use the term corporate because that's not really true at all. But Phil Spencer, uh, I don't really have any thoughts on Phil. I don't really care about like. Um, I try not to follow what like these executives are doing, honestly. I don't really care. Like, I care what the creatives do, but... Like, people, like... I think people, like, put too much emphasis on what, like, the business ex execs do, because I don't think... They're not making the game, so they don't really matter in the grand scheme of things. Like, we don't see people, like, talking about, like, Furukawa, right? Like, why would we? He's just, like, running Nintendo. I don't know. I, I, I do miss a lot of... Like, he'd probably be, like, preparing for retirement now if he lived, but, like... Uh... I don't know. I, I do kind of feel like... I, I kind of miss the days when, like... Eh, it was me against the world when it came to, like, Nintendo coverage. I don't know. For a long time, it felt like I was the only person, like, um... Uh, talking about how Nintendo was being, like, attacked by the, uh, the gaming industry and stuff like that, and now it's, like, basically kind of commonly understood. And I don't know, I don't know how to feel about that. It just feels like, um, hmm, there's nothing more to talk about on the channel or anything. Like, it's very uncommon to, like, find something that, like, other people aren't talking about already. Yeah, I've played this version of the game so many times, it's gonna be weird going to the Game Boy Advance version. I don't know why they released, like, Mario 2... Mario World before 3. Like, doesn't make any sense. Were they not originally intending to release 3? I don't know, like, the, the ports of the, the Game Boy Advance games were actually really popular. The ports of, like, uh, Super Mario Advance was actually a really popular, like, uh, porting series, so... I don't know, maybe it wasn't originally intended to do that? I mean, that's something I've heard, that's like a criticism I've heard of, like, the Game Boy Advance back in the day. Whoops, the fuck? Do you have to get the star? Oh, wow, that's weird. Oh, whoops, ah, damn, I lost her. Yeah, it's been, it's been a while since I played Yoshi's Island, so I think I am going to pop that in today. I'd like to finish Metroid Fusion as well, but eh, we'll see. I was, like, aching to play Dread again, honestly. Like, I've started, like, Dread over again, like, so many times. And, like, I just never finished it. Like, I finished it once, and it, it was such a great game. Like, such a great game, but, like, I've never replayed it. 
and like to this day like every time i i try like i, I just get filtered by something and i just kind of give up it's weird that i get filtered by a game i've already beaten but uh yeah dread is just weird like when you come back to it after like a brief hiatus like you have no idea what you're doing Like, I'm all, I'd almost argue that the map in Dread is too big. But I, I think, like, maybe once I, like, play it enough, I'll, I'll get the hang of it. I would like to be able to just... I'm not sure when I'll have the time to, like, get to that point. Like, the game is almost two years old now, and I, I, haven't, I still haven't come back to it. And, like, to be fair, there's, like, so much that I'm doing, but... I don't know. Like, I, I'm definitely anxious to, like, get to the point where, like, I can just, like, retire and just, like, spend my time, like enjoying the stuff I actually enjoy. I heard I didn't even see that. I thought it was a little bit further. Yeah, I don't think I I don't think I've played through this this year yet. Yeah, I think we're gonna hit the switch and then switch over to Super Mario World 2. Yeah, I like this game a lot, but I just, uh... It's like all my skills related to this game are like revolving revolve around like how how most efficiently to get like the secret exits. That's all I really know how to do in this game. That's all I really care about, honestly. Like speedrunning this doesn't really appeal to me. Oops. Yeah, I agree. So have I. Like that's the thing about Dread is that like I have not played Dread to death yet. Like I have not played Breath of the Wild to death yet. Uh, I have not, like, you know, even finished Here's the Kingdom. Like, there's so many games I'd like to play, and I just haven't... We'll never find the time for. Yeah, remember when this stuff was, like, hard to find? Ugh. Three Super Mario Advance? Yeah, we just talked about that, yeah. I can't wait, honestly. I, I'm really anxious to play, like, some Yoshi's Island. Okay, uh, yeah, we, we gotta stream that today, for sure. <sighs> we started, like, a link to the past, like, last week, too, but I think it's gonna be a while before I get back to that. I think I'm gonna play Ocarina first, actually. <sighs> well, you haven't finished, like, you haven't finished Tears of the Kingdom, really, right? Like, who who's finished Tears of the Kingdom? Like, I haven't. I don't know. I, I, I'm definitely feeling as if, like, I'm not interested in buying new games right now. Because I have so many, sh so much, so many things that I want to play, like, desperately. And I just don't have time for any of it. And then, like, there are days like today where I just end up playing, like, the same games over and over again. I'm definitely getting caught up, though. Uh, definitely. Yeah, I have noticed that. Uh, Mortal Kombat 1 is confirmed to coming, uh, coming to Switch. Which is, uh, interesting. I don't know what it is with MK, but, like, MK has, like... The best, like, Nintendo support of any third-party franchise I've ever seen. Which is just bizarre for me. Like, I think the only World Combat game we've never gotten is... 9. And that is the best one, but, like, I don't know. Like, that's that's what I want from them, is, like, where, where's the port of 9? Like, come on. Yeah, I'm not sure... Uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it, because... 
I um, I really don't like the gay pandering in modern MK. Like, I, I had a severe problem with that. Oh, wait, hang on. Am I not supposed to... Shit. I forgot about, like, the 100% completion thing. Uh... I guess we can just do it later. Damn it. Damn, I kinda wanna reset shit, am I? This is one of those plays. <laughs> I completely forgot how this game worked for a second. I'm just like, wait a minute. Yeah, I think so too. Like, I legit took the week off. I've been playing it, like, I don't want to say non stop, but like, I've been playing quite a bit. And I'm nowhere close. I feel like I'm nowhere close to the end. Like, I, I legit feel that way. Uh, let's see. Like, I, I'm on, like, the last temple, but, like, uh, I don't know what happens after that. Like, I, I still have to get, like, all the dragon tears, and, like, uh, I still have not found a great fairy. I have never upgraded my armor since. <laughs> I, have, I haven't been able to. So, like, I'm getting one shot, one shot by, like, basically everything I come across. Because, like, I don't improve my armor at all. I haven't been able to. Like, hopefully that's something they do in, like, the sequels is, like, really fix, like, the whole, like, farmer progression thing. Because, like, I had no idea where, like, a great fairy is. Like, I came across, like, one, but, like, that required me a quest. It required me to go on a quest to, like, unlock it. And I just don't, I didn't feel like doing it, so. I've just been, like, I've just been, like, uh, like, outsmarting the enemies. Like, I, I just outplay the enemy. And I, I just don't get hit. Unless there are, like, dozens of guys, like, coming after me, like, I just, I'm just not gonna die. The difficulty in that game is really weird, because it's so unbalanced, it feels, like, way too easy. Like, once you start getting, like, better equipment. I feel like I had this problem with, like, Breath of the Wild, too, where it feels, like, overwhelming at first, and then, like, you get the hang of it, and it's just, like, oh, whatever. Like, it's nothing. I mean, it depends on whether or not, like, you have good equipment or not, but it's, like, play the game enough, and you're gonna have plenty of equipment. I thought we were told the Switch didn't have games after Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah, we were told that. Um, just like we were told how, like, Tears of the Kingdom wouldn't be able to compete with Elden Ring. It's, uh, I don't know, like... Right now we're seeing people in denial about, like, the whole, like, um, the narrative being debunked about that. Like, people, like, are refusing to admit they seriously, like, Oh, I love this area, it's so gorgeous. Look at this artwork, like, oh, man, I love this. This has to be, like, one of the most gorgeous, like, locations in any, any Super Nintendo game. Like, look at this. Yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to, uh, the future of Nintendo Switch. Like, anyone who thinks we're not getting new Nintendo games after Victim 4 is, is delusional. Like, at the very least, we'll get something for, like, the holiday. And even that's, like very much pushing it. Like, we're, we're getting Soak Song! Like, we, we have so many, like, good games coming out, confirmed to be coming out for Switch. Like, I don't understand why the RGTs of the world want to, like, keep pushing the narrative that there's something wrong with the console. I don't know, like, these guys just don't like video games. That's the problem. I don't know, Stuttering Craig is doing, like, interviews, like, Talking shit about DSP instead of playing Tears of the Kingdom. So. I, I think that tells you all you need to know. You know? It's like, like, it really does feel that way. Is that like most people are just like doing drama streams and just talking shit about like other people rather than actually, you know, doing something fun or productive.
This is a classic. This is like my favorite game ever. Like, how could you not like it? I really should be playing Tears of the Kingdom right now, but like, I think we're gonna like play a little bit of these classic games. Like, I, I definitely think, yeah, Final Fantasy VI. I think at some point, uh, probably not Link to the Past. I, I mean, maybe we could do a little bit of Link to the Past. We won't like blow through it or anything. This might, that might actually be what we do is just like do a casual run through a Link to the Past. Like, usually when I play A Link to the Past, like, I've been doing this thing where, like, I blitz through the entire thing in, like, a weekend. That's my preferred way to play it. But I think I think maybe just taking it more slowly might be enjoyable. I've been doing that with a lot of these games, actually, because I know I can beat them, so there's no real... There's no real pressure to do it. Yeah, right now you're seeing a lot of people pretending they're, like, pirating Tears of the Kingdom when, like, if you actually, like, look into, like, what that scene is like, you you have, like, a lot of problems with, like, running the underground and stuff like that. Like, it's... It's a load of crap. Here we go. Oops. Fuck. Okay, 14-14. Fuck. Okay, hang on. That was clever. How oh, playing this game reminds me of, like, I wanted to bitch about, like, a specific YouTuber, uh, a specific individual, the most unfunny, like, animator since, like, Eager Raptor, uh, Lowbrow Studios. <laughs> like, I clicked on, like, a video he made the other day of, like, uh, the evolution of Yoshi's. Like, it's some, like, stupid bullshit about, like, Yoshi, like, evolving to be, like, more dangerous. And it's, like, so... All of, like, Lowbrow's content is like this. It's so disgusting. And, like, so unfunny. Like, you're just... You can't even, like... Laugh at it for being so, like, messed up. You're, you're just, like... It's try-hard, like, bullshit. Here we go. Did I miss a red coin? Where is it? Hang on. Fuck! Hang on. It looks like I missed one. One of everything. Guy, okay, I really, I really hate that guy's content. And like, I don't see enough people like bitching about him. But uh, yeah, fuck Low Brow Studios. We're making Sonic for Hire Season Nine because we have nothing else. Like, ah. Uh. Yeah, I missed one. Weird. Yeah, this is one of the first games I ever played. So that, I, I think that's a big reason why I'm so attached to it. Prince Froggy. I know, I probably shouldn't be playing this so soon to, like, the Game Boy Advance release, but... I wish I got through, like... Oh, man, I love, I've always loved the background of this stage. I... like in this underwater area. Okay. Well, they tend to, like, make announcements, like, separate from each other. So we might get an N64 announcement, like, I don't know, a week from now. Hopefully it's, like, Mario Party 3. I've been so anxious 
to, like, play that fucking game again. Like, I played Mario Party 2 to death. Like, I'm... I think I'm done with it. Like, I legit don't think I can play it anymore. I'm so tired. Like, I put 20 hours into that, like... Uh, into the NSO version of Mario Party 2. And, like, that was just, like, playing through it again. <laughs> like, that game is hardcore! I must have put, like, hundreds of hours into that game growing up. Um... It's so good. But yeah, 3 is uh, what I would like. That or 1080, or maybe Excite Bike 64. I mean, there are so many games like I'm looking forward to right now. Like, Pokemon Stadium was like the absolute last choice I would have made. And not because I don't like the game, because I, I love it, right? But like, hold off Pokemon Stadium until you can get like the Game Boy compatibility to work properly. Like, that's what I would have done. Like, I, I don't understand why they released it. Like, the way it was. Because, like, you know people are just going to bitch about that. Like, it's... I mean, I get that, like, emulating that stuff is, like, a pain, but... I would have 100% done it. I don't know. Why don't they make, like, new Pokemon games like that? Like... Why are we still, like, not getting new Pokemon Stadiums? Why did we not get a Pokemon Stadium 3 to begin with? Like, I'm just like, I was so... Even as a kid, I thought that was, like, ridiculous. Coliseum was, like, great but for what it was, but, like, it wasn't a stadium game. Yeah, I definitely gotta play Coliseum again. Uh, that, that's definitely another one. I, I would rather, like, Coliseum be released than... That uh, Pokemon Stadium, honestly. It's been a while since I played Coliseum. I typically what I did growing up, like every time, like I would just like more Pokemon Coliseum is like the Pokemon game I've replayed the most. Like I've uh, I've gone through like all the way to the end several times, and like I've only beaten it once actually because like the ending is so ridiculous. But um, it's a great game. I, I love Coliseum. Like, that's what I like about... Coliseum, like, really, like, innovated when it came to, like, Pokemon campaigns. Because, you know, it, it had, like, a, a more complex story. It had, like, these unique elements to it. It had, like, um, you know, the focus on double battles. Which was, like, different than mainline games. Like, it was its own thing. I, I really valued that. And, like, I, I just feel like these days they would never do something like that. It's just... Uh, it's so frustrating. Like, I don't understand why they can't just, like, do something like, more like that. I think Scarlet and Violet is actually, like, a, a step in the right direction with, like, having multiple, like, quest lines. I don't know what it is with Nintendo. I, I guess they don't want to get too overambitious with, like, having quests and stuff like that. Because, like, Tears of the Kingdom has this problem, too, where, where it feels like the quests are, like, a little bit too simplistic. Like, you don't have, like, a lot of things where you're, like, going across the map to, like, to do completely different things. Like, you're, you're relegated to, like, a very specific area, typically. Hang on, we... Where are all the flowers? I got 30... I got all the red coins, but none of the flowers? What? Yeah, there's a lot of DLC in particular that they haven't, uh, they haven't shown. Like, Splatoon 3... I think will be a big deal. Why don't I play Splatoon 3 tonight? It's been a while since I've played it. I think I will set it up, honestly. Uh... There we go. Oh, fuck! I didn't see that! I was so busy, like, trying not to hit the, the wing thing. Oh, wow. Yeah, that is true. People really don't like talking about how bad Assassin's Creed actually is. Like, I even today, it's weird how, like, Assassin's Creed, like, ten years ago felt like this big thing. And now it's, like, completely irrelevant. Like, Ubisoft in general, like, fell off the map. Like, the last time they were relevant was in, like, the, the early Wii U days. When, like, we thought Watch Dogs was going to be... Well, they thought Watch Dogs was going to be the next big thing. 
And I suppose they were kind of hinging on that, because that was, like, that was the last I ever thought of them as, like, being, like, competitive. Was in that, like, was in that time period, where they were, like, talking about how Watch Dogs was going to be this innovative big thing. And a lot of people bought into it. Like, DSP, like, <laughs> he and John Rambo were in the room when they, uh, when they started shilling it. Like, here we go. I keep mentioning, like, my extensive knowledge of DSP lore. Like, I just, ugh. I, I've been so out of touch with, like, I, I've been so out of touch with, like, detractor communities. Like, uh, without Kiwi Farms, like, I haven't been able to, like, keep up with shit. Like, I have no idea what Nick Riketa's doing. I have no idea what, like, Spoonie's doing. Like, I don't... I, I, I can't keep up with anything without Kiwi Farms. It's, uh... It's kind of... It's kind of weird. I mean, I, I suppose it's for the best to, like, stop caring about these people, but... Um... I don't know. I, I just really feel like Nick Riketa, at the very least, is someone I should be, like, talking about, like, all the time. Like, I very strongly feel that way. Wait, there was no... I missed it? Where, where was it? Hang on. Yeah, where was it? Ah, damn it. I hate it when that happens. I hate it. He'll be Froggy's lunch. I hate it. Hate it when I miss a flower. I hate that. Okay. I mean, I'm glad Assassin's Creed has fallen off the map. It was, it's uh, one of my most, I don't want to call it my most hated franchise ever, but like, it's, it's close. I was like considering like, uh, buying some of the games on Switch and like demonstrating like, you know, how bad they actually are, but I, I just don't, I don't know, I, I just don't think that's a good And they're on sale all the time, so it's not like... Yeah, I agree. Black Flag is unironically like, really good. When you're on the ship. Like, when, <laughs> when you have to, like, do anything else, it becomes shit. But, like, the, the pirate shit is actually pretty awesome. Yeah, I wouldn't mind playing Black Flag again. Uh... Yeah, I love Tears of the Kingdom, but I'm definitely anxious for picking four. Uh, I think we're getting Ghost Trick in June. Uh, so I'll probably play that as well. Oh, thank you. Yes, I'm very happy. Yeah, I hope you guys like it. Oh, yeah, since... Yeah, it was uh, No More Heroes inspired, so I should probably play some No More Heroes. Ah, maybe I should wait till post-release. So I can talk about, like, some of the influences and stuff like that. Yeah, I feel like uh, there, there are certain aspects of Jaw of the Dragon I haven't, like, been... I haven't been talking about. I don't know, I, I don't like talking about my books in general. Like, I really don't. Like, I just prefer, like, making them as good as possible and then just, like, releasing them. Like, I would prefer you guys to, like, fight about certain things. Alright, here we go. Like, oof. Yeah. 
Maybe I lose it. Maybe I lose it. Yes, finally. Yeah, No More Heroes 3 is great. What took you so long? I have, what the fuck? Oh, hang on. Yeah, you're supposed to be like standing down here or something. The hell? Is that how you're supposed to do it? Oh, maybe, maybe the... Okay, hang on. There we go. Okay, so... Use the watermelon seed. Okay. How many pages? I haven't, like, uh, I haven't... I don't... Count the pages, I count the words. So it's about, like, 63,000. I think it's about the same length as the one for it. Wait, am I stuck down here? Holy crap. Yeah, I'll be uh I'll be announcing some future projects in the Black Cat Book Direct as well. Uh, I will be announcing the release date for Jaw the Dragon and uh, some other things too, so please Please keep an eye out for that. Um, did it? I don't remember anything else coming out around the same time. That was uh, 2020, right? Was it really 2020? Holy crap. No, it was 2021, wasn't it? Yeah, it was supposed to come out in 2020. I have, uh, yeah. Like, it will be released, um... Should I announce the release date now? I, I don't see why not. There's no reason to. Uh, June 10th. Yes, uh, I, I have scheduled it. It's, it's June 10th. Yeah, the only reason the pre-orders aren't live yet is because, uh, I'm still getting the cover design, and, uh, once I'm, once that's done, I will, uh, Post the links on the website and oof, the YouTube community page. So yeah, keep an eye out for that, please. Right, here goes. Ah, uh, here we go. Yeah, it's so it must be so difficult to keep up with this stuff because like I don't think anybody knows like everything I'm doing because I'm doing so much stuff. Like lots of people like I don't I don't think the audience for like. Lore and Frey and this will like overlap much at all. I'm very, I'm very interested in seeing how that plays out. Oops. 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 I hope. Yeah, I, I keep confirming things that like I have no intention of confirming on streams. Like people ask me like, when's a book coming out, and I'll just tell them like. Uh, Oops, uh, like, I, I would have liked it, I was going to, I legit thought I was going to get it done, like, uh, by this week, but, like, it was going to come out by this week, but, like, uh, the issue was that, like, Tears of the Kingdom came out, and I didn't want, like, I didn't want to compete with Tears of the Kingdom of all things, so, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to wait, I want to wait a month. Oops. Yeah, I was scared of Tears of the Kingdom. If it was released around like the uh, Elden Ring, I wouldn't have given a fuck. I wouldn't. I wouldn't have cared. Okay. I can't believe I'm bungling this. Like, I thought I, I thought I was at the point where I had everything memorized, but I guess not. Yeah, I think I'm ready to play something else. Love the game, but like, alright, I think it's everything I wanted to play. 
from Super Nintendo. I really gotta get around to playing Earthbound. I don't know why I still haven't done it yet. Should I do DMC? I really want to do DMC and like Valis. Yeah, I, I took a lot of time with it. No, it's about the same. Who cares? Devil May Cry. Ah. Uh. Uh. Yeah, it took me forever to figure out how to beat that thing with, like, the jelly and, like, the, the wall. Like, that was so stupid. Like, ugh. Okay. Hang on. Yeah, mission... Yeah, this part of the game is, like, the worst. Like, at least, like, the beginning half has, like, some cool, cool imagery. And, like, I don't know. But it's been, like, a slog, like, ever since, like... Mission ten or so. I mean, I suppose the I suppose the entire game is kind of like that, but I don't know. The game just is not that good. I, I don't know why this thing is so worshipped. Wow, did you see that? I got a, a stylish by just mashing X. Like, there was no strategy to it at all. Like, I just unleashed the devil trigger and, like, pressed the button. Like, what a joke. It, it, this is the only reason I'm playing the games, by the way, is just, like, kind of shit on them and kind of emphasize why I prefer Bayonetta. Like, I've seen a lot of people, like, in the past, like, couple of years or so really shit on this game. Uh, and I, I can see why. Like, it feels like more people are, like, becoming more open about how bad this game actually is. Uh, I mean, back in the day, this game was, like, Warship, so... It's it's cool to see like more people start like shit talking it. I mean the problem now is that they've started like doing the same thing with like DMC three, four, five. was that? I wish I was thought that. Yeah, I bet you. <laughs> I bet you do. Castlevania wannabe. It really is. I'm, I'm, sur I'm surprised more people don't, like, bring that up. Like, it's not even as good as Castlevania. It is the poor man's Castlevania. Like, if you're a girl and you have, like, a thing for Dante, like, I, I can see that. But, like, I don't know. I wouldn't respect your opinion if you tried to tell me Double May Cry is, like, better than Castlevania. Like... That would be like if I said that, like, uh, uh, Soul Calibur 
Hang on. What's a good example? I'm trying to think of, like, a game I don't really like with a hot chick. But what's a good example? Tomb Raider, maybe? I definitely have started, like, seeing the appeal of, like, Lyric Rock. Like, classic Lyric Rock, as opposed to, like, the remake one. I've always liked the remake one, but, like, uh... Oh, did I fuck this up again? Oh, that's right, I did. Damn it. Why am I so stupid? I keep forgetting to do this. Every time I come down here. You're supposed to spin the thing. All right. I don't I don't think Rain is all that hot. I know she's a vampire. I know but I, I don't typically like uh, red-haired vampires. I don't like girls with red hair in general, honestly. That's just not my thing. Like, I, I, I shit talk blondes all the time, but like, you know, I, I've been with blondes. It's not like a, it's not like a deal breaker or anything. I don't think I've ever been with anyone with red hair. Oops. There we go, Quicksilver. There we go. What the fuck? Did I just jump across? That was weird. Alright. Yeah, I tried playing it a while ago. Uh, because of the vampire waifu thing. Like, people were pushing me to, to play it for that reason. So I played it on stream and it was garbage. Like, I, there was nothing good about it. Nothing. Like, I don't even think I'll, like, try the sequels. And, like, that, that thing was, like, worship. That, that thing, like, had an audience back when it came out, right? Like, I like girls with black hair. Like, what's weird about that? If Virgil is so strong, why is this like. <laughs> why is this guy still a little bitch? What's the lore? This is like mind controlled Virgil. Like, after. Like, Virgil has never won, like, a fight with Dante, right? Like, every time you play as Dante, you beat Virgil. So, like, Dante has to be stronger than Virgil, right? What the fuck? Every time I fight this guy, like, I just... Hang on. Uh, I'm gonna... Use a retry orb, I think. Grenade launcher is, like, the most OP thing imaginable. You can just... Got me. DMC is too hard. Eh, I'm not sure I like spicy. <laughs> wow! He's just standing there just taking it. What a little bitch. Alright, here we go. There can be only one, uh. Oh. There can be only one son of Sparta, uh. Here we go. Oops. I'm sure I'll put up more of a fight in DMC3. Look at this, I've already shredded like half his life bar. Ninja Gaiden has so much better, like, rival fights. Oh, oh, boss fights in general, I should say. It's not even funny. Like, I, I don't know why anybody... That was it?! What a joke! What is with this eat? Ugh, damn! Embarrassing.
That's the last time you fight him, right? I can't believe the guy who made this went on to make something as good as Bayonetta. Like, oof. It's the JRPG amulet. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. How far did I get? I beat like three temples. Uh, so I'm near the end. Well, I think I'm near the end. We'll, we'll play it later tonight, don't worry. Okay. Unspeakable. Bio mutant? Uh, I'm not sure. I am um, certainly considering it. Wasn't that was that one of those games that people were saying like couldn't run on Switch or some shit? So wait, Dante can't even get into the underworld without a pendant. Okay. Like, how likely do you think it is that, like, all the really strong demons just never actually, like, get into Earth? Like, leave the underworld. Like, like Yu Yu Hakusho Ladrin. Sparta. It's the true form of the Force Edge. Do I not have the... Should I use the Force Edge, or should I... I think I'm gonna stick, try using the Force Edge. It's the same weapon, is it just stronger? But I spent the entire game powering up the Elaster. Okay, whatever. What is with the pacing of this game? How are you supposed to upgrade all these weapons when, like, you're better off just sticking with, like, a single one? Well, I had the same problem with Bayonetta 3. Oh, here we go. Oh, man. Uh, is that a mini game? Oh, no. It's just like Bayonetta 3. Oh, no. It's a borderline unplayable. I'm, st I'm, still, I'm still mad about that. Like, oh. gun is like so powerful that it can like shred through like all of these enemies that take that like the legendary force edge couldn't couldn't handle like oh, damn is this even the sword that dante uses in like five like is this sword just completely forgotten about oops underwater what the fuck What sense does that make? Wait, okay. What am I supposed to do? I'm just gonna climb the stairs like a normal human being and <sighs> no mini games. This is not bad in a three. Okay. Okay, I think what you're supposed to do is just swim up and then The puzzles in this game are, are, are straight garbage. Like I don't see anyone like talking about how garbage the puzzles are in Devil May Cry. 
Like, they're just so bad. door up here, right? Right? There it is, okay. Man, I'm not bothering with that shit. What am I supposed to do? Okay, hang on. Just ask me where I'm supposed to go next, right? Those who seek the truth shall put the egg in the basket. What egg? What the fuck is he talking about? Uh... So I need to find an egg? Oh, where do I get an egg? Like, is there a giant chicken I need to, like, just reach into and drag it out? <laughs> okay, uh... Okay. Yeah, it has- it can't be back- it has to be somewhere in this room, right? Remember this part of the game very well. Uh, I think this is the point where it starts getting like a little bit better again uh, after like the just the long string of just terrible missions. But uh, I don't. Hey, oh, <laughs> open that door while it was still underwater. That's hilarious. That's funny. Uh. One. <laughs> Just like, okay. Okay. So he wants an egg, but... I don't know, could it have been, like, in the room with the... With the reavers, or...? I guess we can just go up and see if we can find something. We... Fuck, oh, hang on. Oh, damn it! Oh, the hell was that? I saw a flash. I saw something yellow. I think that was it. Okay, come on. Where's the flash? I think it's to the right. There it is. Okay, that should be it. Philosopher's Egg? I've heard of a Philosopher's Stone, but... <laughs> Philosopher's Egg? Really? I really do like research how alchemy is supposed to work, because I definitely want to incorporate it into uh, the books, but I, I just haven't researched it yet. Yeah, there's definitely times where I feel like I in, I use things that I don't know enough about. Here goes. Oh, it, it's the same thing. This thing again? Are you joking? What is 
problems with this game and like constantly reusing its garbage bosses? I think it's easier this time now. Uh, no, no, Dante! Stop auto targeting the enemy and. Okay. Okay. All the bosses in this game are garbage, but they keep reusing them over and over again. There we go. Uh, wait, where's my devil trigger? Does this thing not have a devil trigger? Why am I not allowed to use a devil trigger? Okay. Garbage fight! Oh, hang on. I just fought this thing like a handful of missions ago. I, I did it off stream because like I was I was struggling to figure out how to do it because it's so stupid. Oh fuck! Damn it, I forgot. Again? This giant chicken? Ah, oh, here we go. How is this even, like, an attack? Like, you you fight minor enemies that heal you when you when you kill enough of them. It just You get more red herbs and orbs this way? Like... Okay. Hopefully this is the last time we fight this thing, because I hate this boss. I really do. Uh... Shoot it! Why do I have to jump up here to hit it? Alright. Okay, let's uh, kill this guy. Okay. The chicken can't fight me. Hang on. Chicken isn't strong enough that would hang on. At least the spider had that like that shield thing that made it impossible to hit. This thing is just like a waste of time. There you go. Okay, it's dead. Get my orbs, do. Hover in the air and shoot lightning? How do you do that? I, I don't actually know what you're talking about. You're not thinking of DMC2, are you? With like the with like how the handguns are the most overpowered things in the world. What are you doing? The camera angle protected him! Oh, here we go. Okay, hang on. Okay. I can't even see the boss. And there are people who bitch about the uh, the camera angles in Bayonetta 3. Okay, here we go. Uh, no, fuck you. Uh, I am not doing this again. Fuck you. Okay. Okay, I probably didn't need to do that, but like, uh, I was, I was getting paranoid. What the hell was that? Like, the camera was spinning all over the place. All right.
Why did they throw in an achievement system? I just... Alright, whatever. I was playing this garbage game an achievement. Okay, uh... Okay, next mission. Enter the Corrupted World. Uh, power up. Wait! Force Edge doesn't have its own power up set? Why? Like, I feel like I should just stick with Elaster if it has, like, Devil Triggers. Like, why would I not want to use the Devil Trigger? Like, that doesn't make any sense to me. Air Hike. I haven't, like, learned anything. Uh, I'm not sure I wanna... Did it surpass Tomb Raider? Did I don't think it did. I, I really don't. Like, I have played some of the older Tomb Raiders. If anything, I think, uh... What the hell? Okay, it's done. But where the hell am I supposed to go now? Like, do you get upgrades for Force Edge eventually? I, I don't remember. I'd like to say you do, but... Why is the castle getting darker? Dude, 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 dude. How can you look at Lara Croft and think that, like, oh, I, I'd much rather play as Nathan Drake than her? Like, what, what are you, what's wrong with you? Like, I think 2 is my least favorite. Well, 2 is the one I played last, so that's probably why, but... I don't understand what's with this mirror. Like, what is with this weird Silent Hill? Like, okay. Yeah, now we're ripping off Silent Hill. Oh, here we go. Oops. Our $1 bid games. Yeah, I, I can see that. Like, I don't... Hmm. What the hell is this? Nightmare... Beta? I don't think that's even better than the grenade launcher. Let me see. What the fuck? It's a laser beam. Okay. Uh, I think we're gonna stick with the grenade gun. Oh hell yeah! That thing is so badass. Why would you ever switch it out? Okay. Uh... Well, like, not PlayStation gives away all their games to try and get those numbers up. So I think you can get them for like three. Philosopher's Stone. Oh man. It was in the mirror, too. Was this, like, deliberately ripping off Harry Potter? Okay. Yeah, someone should ask him to get that on Twitter. Oh, no! He's wearing a mask! Yeah. That's def... And something one of the things I appreciate about the game is like the horror vibe. I I like the tone of this game so much more than the sequel. Like it actually looks cool and badass. With like the enemies and like the character designs and stuff. Like afterwards it just becomes a joke. Like you can't take it seriously. What? What the 
was happening there? I was getting hurt by the corpse? What sense does that make? Okay, hang on. Is it where I jumped down in it? Okay, so I got the Philosopher's Stone. What do I do with it? I mean, they're all on PC now, so they have to be, like, more attainable than ever. Like, I was considering playing them again. I think I might at some point if I can get them for, like, ten bucks, you know. It might be on my wish list. I don't know. Uh, here we go. Wait, what the fuck? Where am I supposed to go? Wait, hang on. I go back or is that what I'm supposed to do is just like go back these areas so what is that mission Open the gate to the underworld. Okay, well, how do I do that? Well, in Bayonetta, you go to Phil Coolbenter. <laughs> okay, yeah, we can't go back. Okay. So this is a waste of my time. Okay. Yeah, I completely forgot. Uh, I'd like to finish this tonight. It might be possible. Something I don't get, like, I, if I remember correctly, the underworld is, like, harder up until, like, the final boss. Uh, hang on, do I stand here, or no? The door is vanished? Did I jump out the window? I thought this was the place where, like, you left out the window or, or something. Dante is scared of, like, vanishing doors. Why? was that? Alright. Uh, okay, there's... Keep going around in circles. Where am I supposed to go? These are dogs? Oh, really? Okay. 
Yeah, I, I guess I should. Yeah, I need to focus on getting all the tiers. I uh, I have like seven of them to go. I, I haven't been focusing on one at all. So I probably should go ahead and do that. I was like, I stopped last night, like trying to get one. I I couldn't figure it out. Um. Yeah, I've got to get that. I got to get that finished for sure. Yeah, in general, I feel like Tears of the Kingdom handles a lot of things that like is a series high point. I, I really do. Like, obviously, like, I've been nitpicking some things when it comes, like, to writing and stuff like that, but, like, overall, it's, it's fantastic. Like, people who are bitching are only doing so because they're jealous. I agree. Um, I mean, people just won't do it, though. Like, you, you still kind of have that experience with, like, Nintendo games. And, like, people will just try to tell you that, like, oh, we're just not interested in Nintendo games. And that just... It, it's complete crap, because there's so many different... Like, this is a Nintendo game, right? Because it's on a Nintendo console. Like, are you telling me you wouldn't like something like that? No, I, I don't believe that. What am I supposed to do with the Philosopher's Stone? If that be Zelda. Am I supposed to, like, go back? I can't be right, right? I don't think you can go back. by, like, the fact I'm surrounded by water than the monsters themselves. Oh, that's something people don't talk about is that uh, Dante's weak to water, apparently. Because, <laughs> like, you can see his life meter just slowly going down. Again? Oh, hang on. What's this? Where the hell am I? But I have the Philosopher's Stone. There we go. Okay. Why did it take me so long to figure out where to go? Like, was there any indication? I just guessed. Like, okay. That should not have taken me 12 minutes. Like, half of that time was spent, like, wandering around trying to figure out what I was supposed to do. There were no enemies to fight. I was just... Ugh. Okay. Showdown with Nightmare. Uh, okay. Who's Nightmare? There are like, what, 23 missions in this? It's 23 or 23. Alexa, how many missions are in the original Devil May Cry? <laughs> Alexa, how many missions are in Devil May Cry? According to an Alexa Answers contributor, 69 missions. The fuck? That's not right. Fuck you, Alexa. What is with her giving me incorrect information? It's 22 or 23. I think 3 has 21, but it's not like fucking 62. What is she talking about? Like, where is she getting these bullshit numbers? Ugh. 
kind of love how unintimidating hell is in Devil May Cry. Look at this shit. I think this thing does more damage than the Laster does. Because it's cutting right through these things. They're not as strong as they used to be when I first bought them. I mean, they were already not very strong, but... Got it. Okay, there's the statue. Don't care. Oh, you hit you hit the door like ah oh, it's fucking Metroid oh, okay Dante. it's Trish Dante, help me. Trish. don't believe her Dante don't believe her lies Again? I fought this thing twice already! Okay, is it slightly different? She's behind a force field, I think she's gonna be good. What the fuck? Again? What were they thinking? I was bored with the tears of this thing the first time! Okay, hang on. boss that requires you to hit on like a switch that doesn't really seem to do anything worst worst thing ever like okay hang on hang on where's my vital star Firing towards the ground. He's on the ceiling. All right. Okay. Damn it, he got me. Alright, let's try this again. Again? Like, why am I doing the same thing? Who makes you fight the same bosses over and over again? Like, Bayonetta gives you a lot of variety in how you, like, you encounter these things. But, like, here it's the same encounter. Like, three times each. Like, back to back! Like, what were they thinking? Alright. <sighs> okay. Yeah, okay, hang on. Virtual fights exactly like you do, only like slower. Fuck. That was stupid. Like, what? Hey, 
I'm running out of like reset orb. I'm so frustrated that I have to fight this thing again. Like, why? Yeah, I think I'm. I think I'll stop for now. Ugh. I got to the underworld. I'm near the end. We'll probably finish it next time I play it. Uh, Final Fantasy VI or Tears of the Kingdom? Resident Evil Four. I think we might play some Tears of the Kingdom. We've been putting it off like long enough. And then we'll probably play like RE4 and like some good games. Ugh. Yeah, Miyazaki's a fraud. I, I don't know why so many people, like, swear by him as, like, one of the all-time greats. I mean, it, it's just a shit on Nintendo, but... Yeah, I've, I've got to play more D DMC5, for sure. I've got to I gotta finish 4. I'm, I'm going to go through the entire series again. Okay. So check this out. Like, I found this, uh, this place, and I can't find the tier. I, I think, um, I don't think I've gotten it yet. It's not on the map or anything. It's not indicated. So I think, I like how it's not laying flat against the ground. That just triggers me. Ugh. Triggered. Yeah, a lot of people will, like, um, have been trying to tell you, have been trying to convince themselves that DMC5 is, like, one of the best games ever made. That's, like, a legit thing that's happening right now. Um, and, it, and it's absurd, but they're really trying to push that. Because they don't have anything else, right? I don't love these ghosts that just want... Oh, here it is! Find it! Finally! Holy crap! Oh no, is she dead? Oh no! Not Sonya, I barely knew you! Oh, Zelda. She does look better in this game than she did in the last one. Go. Before you face the Demon King tomorrow, there is something I must tell you. I came. I came to this era after finding a man on the ground. He doesn't give a fuck. He doesn't give a fuck. When I witnessed what the secret stone did to Ganondorf, at that moment, I knew for sure what we found underground, that was him. He was still alive, still powerful. He continues to live on all the way into my time. In tomorrow's battle, we won't be able to defeat him. No matter how strong we think we are, he'll survive. Yes. And you... We. And you... How does Sonya die? Uh. Maybe so. It is my duty to try. I've seen people, like, rail on the story for this game. It's way better than the story for Breath of the Wild. Like, there are things you can talk about my that are ridiculous. Set us on this path. 
but it's definitely way better than Breath of the Wild. And above all else, I remain the King of Hyrule. As with any leader, it is my duty to safeguard and protect my people. Base! Even if I must risk my life. Yeah, I think I might do that. I think uh, I have all the towers found, so I might I might do that. We rely on your I need to stockpile weapons anyway for the for the boss. Our last line of defense will be Link. Link. But remember, that was a future where you never appeared in this world. You are here now. Wait, wait, what? Zelda. I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. What the fuck is he talking about? Wait. Okay. So, like, originally, did Zelda not come back? So, like, did she change the timeline? The reason I am here. Okay. Yeah, I, I've been anxious to, like, me haunt memories, but I just... I've been getting them as soon as I find them, but I, I just haven't... I haven't come across a lot of them. I think a lot of them must be in the south, because uh, it's the it's the region I haven't explored that much. Okay, how many do I have left? Uh, how many are there? Uh, adventure log... Serenade will be a fairy. Okay. Dragon's Tears. You have six left. Okay. So we're about ha almost halfway. I look at a guide because I'm not sure where else they could be. Hang on, I have an album. Let's see. Okay. Uh, assuming I'm not a dipshit. Okay. I took it at the wrong angle, like a dumbass. Okay. So that's the castle in the middle, right? So it looks... Wait, hang on. Is that the one I just got? Uh... Yeah, it looks like there's one in the desert. Right? Okay. Yeah, Zelda 1 and 2 are still classics. Absolutely. Yeah, I think that's the one I just got. Was the one over here? By the river? Yeah, yeah, okay. So, there's one in the mountain. And Okay, so I think if we just go to the tower and then go up, we should see it. I think. That's one of the things I really like about this game, is that, like, it doesn't mark things on your map. You're supposed to just figure it out. So, like, there's room for getting lost, and there's room for error, and, like, you know, not taking into account something. It is positively Kino. That's definitely something I really love about this game, is that they really respect your intelligence. Okay. Uh... Yeah, yeah, I, I gotta do that on stream for sure. If it's that big of a deal, yeah, I gotta, I gotta do this now. Uh, what the fuck is that block? Hang on, okay. Uh, okay. There it is. Yep. Easy enough to find. Okay. Yeah, we we have them all on the map, so I think we're good. I think I'm at the point now in the game where I can just kind of do whatever. Um. So I think now's a good time to get all the all the memories. Okay. Yeah, that was easy enough to find. Okay, so there's one like due north. Yeah, 
yeah, yeah, Tunic did come up on Switch. I have it on my wish list. I'm definitely going to play it as soon as I have the time. I, I mean, not the time. I'm, once I beat out all the other millions of games I have to get through. Like, Tunic looks... Uh, I've heard Tunic is great. Like, I've heard nothing but good things about Tunic. So I'm, I'm very excited about it. Fuck, it's built on the mountain? Okay. That is, uh, that is concerning. Okay. So it's always in flat ground. It's not, I don't have to, like, go mountain climbing, right? It couldn't be right next to me, huh? Uh, alright. It's a pretty big one, though. Hang on, that's... Why is it built into the mountain? Why can I not just find it? Alright. Is that it? Damn it. Uh, I'm going to spend more time, like, finding the puddles than actually getting the... Actually finding the, the marking. Needle on a hair stack, huh? Why are they so big? Okay. Yeah, the, uh, the flashback sequences I've seen have been, like, positively keen on. Like, some of them are... I, I'm i really anxious to, like, see Zelda move past, like, this flashback shit. Because I think if it was, like, part of, like, an actual narrative, it would actually be really, really good. Like, the problem is that, like, everyone just sees everything out of order and they get confused. Like, I've seen people say that the story of this game is terrible, but it's it's not. Um, it, it, it's way better than Breath of the Wild, for sure. That's actually one of the main phrases I have for it, is this, like, you feel so much more involved in what's going on, for the most part. I really? Of course it was going to be near the top. Why did I start near the bottom? It would have been easier to just come up and... Uh, if you had Revali's Gale... Why do I not have Revali's Gale? Why do I have to, like, start from scratch? Like, yeah. Do I not get all the, the champion powers back? That's so weird. But hilariously, the fact that they did this completely, completely changes the way the game is played, so it feels completely different. You actually have to, like, climb mountains. Instead of doing what you do, like, once you get Revali Scale and Breath of the Wild, and just, like, um, and just, like, find the optimal point to just leap off. So there we go. Is that it? No, fuck. Uh, is this snow? What is this white stuff? How was there snow right next to a desert? Yeah, whatever. Here it is. Here it is. Okay. Yeah, I played Crucible Blast. I liked it. Allow me to offer you my deepest apologies. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Taking so long to accept your repeated invitations. No! Raru, no! Don't believe his lies! Oh no! Why would you trust this man? I will accept your vow of fealty to the kingdom of Hyrule. I understand that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Receiving such an appeal from you, a hero to his people and a king by birth. No. Well, it is truly 
reassuring. If it was a woman, though, oh, we wouldn't trust you. It is Come on. My honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. Hey, this was before Hyrule. They founded Hyrule. Risen above your admirable lineage. What are you talking about? It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. All except you and your sister, that is. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings, these will endure for generations to come. So there aren't like that many Zonai, all right. Your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. Do you trust this individual? <laughs> Do you trust this guy? Zelda, say... Oh, don't tell me she's gonna do it! King Yoru, I believe that man's heart holds... Oh, Gerald! Here we go again! Just as me and he can pass. <laughs> oh, no! Every single time! ...his evil nature. For that reason, and others, I want him close. It will be easier to keep an eye on him. <laughs> no! Nothing to worry about. Of course. Oh, no. Why would you trust this man? Ugh, okay. He's so obviously evil. Like, if Reru seriously said that, like, he completely trusted Ganondorf, like, I would just be like, come on, bro. Like, was that what it looked like in Ocarina? Like, we've never actually seen that, uh, that sequence, like, uh, what they were actually talking about. We never actually see the king. <laughs> in theory, it could have been him! Okay. Uh, okay. Now, it's weird how many parallels that has with Ocarina. That, that's weird. Very uncanny. Absolute Kino, though. Okay. I don't know, I definitely like how it's uh how it's incorporating so many aspects from older games. Like, you know, this has like sky a lot of skyward sword elements, uh Ocarina elements. Yeah, this is the most time travel has played into Zelda since since Ocarina, I think. I'm sorry, Imager's mask. Yeah, it's weird that like time travel became such a big part of like the Zelda franchise, and then was just dismissed just as quickly. That's actually what I was like hoping we would get out of Tears of King Tears of the Kingdom initially, is that you would be able to go back like to the, to the calamity, and like do shit there. But eh. I mean, it's what I would have done. But. Oh, hang on. Yeah, I guess we can... Yeah, we don't need to climb up. Okay. Uh, okay, there's one to the north. Directly to the north. Around the bridge? Yeah, there's, there's, there's a tower around there. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is with, like, Devil's Third and then, like, constantly trying to change the name. Like, I get the name became toxic, but, like, holy crap. Like, I don't understand why that was, like, ugh. That was such a weird situation. Like, that game should not have been hated the way it was. Like, hopefully it makes a comeback on Nintendo consoles, but... Okay. I can't see anything from up here. We're gonna have to drop. So 
So where is it? It's like... Yeah, right behind me. Right? Yeah, there it is. Okay, so I am... Where am I exactly? Okay, so I think... By the river, right? So I think I might just go straight. God hand. I don't know. Have we have we seen a game get that that much hate since? Like that's the thing that bothers me about Devil's Third is that like we haven't seen any games like that have gotten railed on like that one did. Oh, here it is. All right. I'm out of pins. Like I keep running out. Hi-Fi Rush and Forspoken did the magic hand thing better. Weird that they do kind of, like, overlap. Does Hi-Fi Rush have a magic hand? I know Forspoken does. But I, I didn't know anything about Hi-Fi Rush's magic hand. BMC Nero did it the best? <laughs> yeah, sure. I feel like I haven't had to like boost my stamina meal all that meal all that much. I've just been like cruising around. Like getting heart pieces. I feel like I haven't done any shrines in forever. I mean to be fair, I'm focusing on like other things, but at this point. Like I feel like I have enough hearts. Like the problem is that like I can't take hits. Because my armor is shit. Like I can't find any great fairies. I've been dicking around for hours and still haven't, like, found shit. How many left? Five? Hang on, I think we should just have Dragon Tears. How many side quests are there? Okay. Oh, hang on, it's not even really. There are five, okay. Oh no, it's a spiral. Ah. <laughs> this area is contaminated by spirals. Oh, here we go. Fuck. It's been so long since I read Uzumaki. I really gotta do it again. I'm, I'm getting to the point where I'm starting to like, revisit some of my, like, uh, some of the manga series I got into. Uh, Dr. Stone uh, being the most blatant example. So, I think, I think, um, I'd really like to reread Uzumaki. But I have, like, so much manga lying around. Like, I never... I never finished, like, that monster volume I got. And monster is, like... I read enough of it to, like, know it's, like, absolute Kino. And I just... Ugh. I just I just stopped reading it. Like, I got, like, legit upset at, like, some of the implications at some of the things that were happening in monster. <laughs> like, I'm just, like... I didn't even get that far in. Like, I think that, like, manga is gonna, like, destroy me emotionally. Like, I really do. <laughs> Two stamina wheels? Really? Uh, what the fuck are these douchebags here? Who's Impa? Why is it chained down? Yeah, Impa's no help. Yeah, I've, I've, uh, I don't know any, I still don't know anything about it. I've read, like, a couple of, a little bit of, like, the first volume, and it was just so good, and I just never got back to it. I don't know, I'm so, like, swamped with, like, manga I need to read right now, it's just, it's ri just ridiculous. Like, I've been putting off, like, reading Fire Force and, like, Full Metal Alchemist forever. Like, I, I, I don't know, it feels weird reading the manga after Full Metal Alchemist after, like, growing up, hearing about the anime and stuff like that, you know? Like, I just, ugh. I just can't decide what I want to do. And I probably will just go for the manga. 
Yeah, I read like I read like a little bit of Doctor Stone before I went to bed last night, and it really is just pure Kino. I, I just I really is one of my favorites. And I think it's not all that popular either, which is interesting. I don't know, like I haven't looked at like uh the popularity rankings, but like uh, I know One Piece is the most popular, but you know, for a good reason, One Piece is awesome, but like uh, I don't think Dr. Stone is anywhere near, like, the top five, is my impression. And it's such a shame, too, because I, I love Dr. Stone. Yeah, definitely. I, I, I definitely feel that way now, at this point, yeah. Like I try, wa I try watching anime, but like it's just too time-consuming. And then like filler is a problem, and then you have like issues with like the the quality going down with like in between seasons and, and stuff like that. <laughs> what the hell is it? Yeah, I'll probably watch Cowboy Bebop. Like, I, I haven't... I tried committing to, like, watching, like, an episode of Cowboy Bebop a day. And I haven't been able to stick with it. I watched the first episode again. What the fuck was that? Uh... I guess we could just fly up here. Yeah, I think I think I like Cowboy Bebop a lot. Uh, going by that first episode. But I, I just haven't gotten around to it. I don't see it. Where the hell is it? The fuck? Well, yeah, I don't see it. Why is this so annoying? That looks like a tear, but that's not what I'm looking for. Uh... Yeah, it's, still, it's not going to be anywhere near where Ampa is. Uh... No. Space Dandy? Yeah, I've seen I've seen a couple of episodes of it, yeah. I, I didn't think it was funny. Um... I don't know, I feel like I have, like, weird days in anime. Like, people recommend me some stuff, and I just don't like it. Like, I I'm very big on, like, hating waifu stuff. Unless it's, like, Call of the Night, which I, which I love. Like, I legit put together, like, a top ten, like, manga and anime, my favorite, like, top ten anime and manga lists. Like, I was going to put it, I was going to, like, put it on my YouTube channel, and then, like, uh, first of all, like, I completely forgot about, like, a good number of, like, series I really, really enjoy. Uh, Yu Yu Hakusho, I remember I forgot to put on it. And I think more. Uh, but, like, yeah, one of the series that did make the cut was, like, Call of the Night. So, I, I do think, uh, <laughs> I am, unfortunately, like, <laughs> kind of a dork. I, the last volume was really, really good. So, I, I think at this point, I'm, like, willing to, like, unironically admit I love it. Uh... I don't know. I was, like, very embarrassed to admit it for a long time, but yeah, I'm a fan of Call of the Night. Oof. Yeah, three guesses as to why. Ah, right, here we go. Oops. Don't tell me she, like, parked it. Oh, here! I was walking right by it! What? I walked over it! Okay. It was right there. What the fuck? Okay, hang on. Okay.
Oh no! <laughs> no! Are you well? You seem a bit distracted. I apologize. I keep getting lost in my thoughts, thinking about how I can return home. Draw the dragon begins to the gazebo, just like this. Your power over time. If I were able to learn that kind of control, I might be one step closer to my era. I see. The secret is to think of it like drawing out the object's memory. You ask the object where it was, how it arrived where it is now, and then you coax it back to that original moment in time. Sonya is such a weird character, because, like, she's had so much less focus on Rairu has. I'm sure it will become almost like second nature, and you will be able to find your way home. This is the closest Zelda's ever had to a mother. There is more on your mind than just that. You, of course, do want to get back to your tribe. But you also desperately want to help us out in this era. Am I close to the truth? How did you know? <laughs> I do not believe it is possible to keep anything secret from Sonya. <laughs> oh, your concern is very sweet, Zelda. But listen, you can focus your attention on returning home. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. Yes. Both of these powers will help you protect your Yes. Duh, duh. Queen Sonya. And of course, you must make it home safe to the Blinks mind at least. Blinks? That is not a name I have heard. Wait, what? He is a royal knight. He had been originally appointed for my protection. Why did... But later, he became a hero by saving both me and Hyrule from a great evil. Oh, a hero is he? He is so very dedicated, and he refuses to back down <laughs> from any. Why? Why did she not tell him about Link? He is very strong. <laughs> the strongest. And his heart is good and true. Ah, oh, she's totally into him. I can see that you have absolute faith in him. Hearing you speak so highly of Link, I find myself wanting to meet him as well. Rara. Indeed. I would also like to meet him. He must be quite the brave, courageous knight. What a picture Zelda paints of him. Zell Link confirmed. Yeah, that seems to be the, imp the impression I get. I, I I like Zelda a lot more in this game. Like, I guess she's grown up a lot. She was a she was a brat in Breath of the Wild. I fucking hated her in that game. But this one, she's like perfectly likable. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Okay, North. Okay, there's two right next to each other. It looks like. I think I got one of them. I think I didn't get the second one. So I think if I go north, go to Reno Village. Yeah, Mifa fans of PTFO. Like, who the fuck likes... Who the fuck wants Link to fuck the fist? Like, I like Mifa as a character. I really do. But, like, I didn't want her to literally... No! Like, that's disgusting! <laughs> like... Like, if I wanted Link, like, to get with anyone in Breath of the Wild, it was probably, uh, probably Paya. I much preferred Paya to, like, Zelda in Breath of the Wild. I haven't, like, I actually just met, like, Paya last night, and I haven't, like, really gone into, like, what she's like in this game. She seems like she's grown up a lot. Uh. Fuck, hang on. This is the impression I got. Uh. I'm not sure if that's a good or bad thing. Here we go.
I think I think I think David Jaff is a complete pleb and, and should shut his mouth. Like, who who cares what David Jaff says? Like I'm sick of people like covering him. Like oh he made God of War. So God of War was shit. Like it was never good. Hang on, I think it's more. Okay, by the lake, it looks like. Was... Yeah, I think more to the right, maybe? Uh, wait, where the hell am I? Okay, let's spin this way. If I don't know exactly where I'm going... Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep going straight ahead. Like, I, I've been, like, resharing that video of, like, David Jaff versus DSP in uh, Metroid Dread for a while now for a reason. Holy crap! This is the same place I was at... Holy crap, this is the same area... I was just here in Breath of the Wild! Wow! Damn, that is weird. Just completely by chance, too. All right. Uh... Okay. I can't see anything. Fuck. I still gotta get obnoxious. This has to be the right area, right? Let's see. Okay, by the pond. I think it's, it looks like on the, it's on the other side. Uh... Yeah, he's like the the game development equivalent equivalent of like Nick Regata. Like it, it legit is the exact same thing. Like if you're so good at games, like make more. Like. I'm Dark Side Phil. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I agree. Like, Western developers are, like, so full of shit. Like, there's a reason everybody hates them. I don't understand why they're all, like, all so shit. Like, what's the reasoning behind it? Like, they're all the same, and I just don't understand why. Like, the guy who made, like, uh, Cereza and the Lost Demon, uh, he's a Westerner, right? He's, like, Canadian. Like, that guy doesn't strike me, like, the same as being the same as David Jaff. You know, like, it's it's really noticeable. Wait, hang on. Is that? No. Fuck. I'm struggling. Uh... Am I sure I didn't get this one already? Yeah, okay. Yeah, there's one up here. So I think, like, yeah, there's definitely... Yeah, I think there's supposed to be two here. Like, one... One here, and then one, like, by Rito Village. It's a good thing this landmass hasn't changed at all in, like, the past 100 million years or whatever the fuck. Okay. Like, David Jaff, I legit have less respect for David Jaff than I do for DSP. Like, David Jaff, like, DSP will actually, like, at least play the fucking game. Is that a Lionel? That is the first Lionel I've ever seen. I was beginning to wonder if they were even in the game. Okay. Uh. Yeah, I'm not sure I can take one, so. It's not a silver, but. I don't know why anybody takes, like, David Jaff seriously. He's such a joker. Like, ugh, I hate him. Is he still chasing me? Okay, hang on. Uh... I'm more concerned about, like, the fucking... Uh, I can't see through the blizzard. Yeah, 
Yeah, God of War was always shit. I, I don't know who, like, actually enjoyed playing those games. Like, looking back on it, like, even Devil May Cry is better. And, like, I know Devil May Cry fans, like, have always shit on God of War, but, like, it's like, how did this game ever find an audience? Like, it just... I suppose that was, like, the beginning of, like, the PlayStation exclusive phenomenon. Where, like, people were worshipping, like, these mediocre games, but... Like, oof. Yeah, where is it? Like, can you even see them with all the snow? It's possible we went right past it and we didn't see anything. That's a moose. Man, that's a good thing. Like, they're making games for, like, an audience they hate. That's uh, that's an interesting thing about Jap and, like, Blazinski. Is that they really, really hate their audience. And I, I don't know what, why. Like, what's the... What's the reasoning behind it? Let's see... Yeah, I got... Um, I ordered another... I ordered a Zelda shirt from Etsy. I'm really excited for it. I, I love ordering these, like, custom shirts from... Hang on. Uh I'm not even looking at like how to figure this out. I'm I'm looking at my like my information. Narrative? Okay. Ah. I can't remember if I cried the last time I watched the Princess Bride. Yeah. Said you were all on my own bed. Baby, just, just relax. Don't, don't hurry. this cost i don't even remember how much it cost but All right, we should probably look up, like,
all the locations uh, for this stuff. I'm kind of tired of dicking around for them, honestly. Let's see. Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, wait, are these the Tears of the Kingdom? <laughs> I never even thought about that. What to know about Dragon Tears? Tear, where am I? Okay. I guess we should get them in order? Uh, let's see, which one are we missing? Okay. Where am I? Okay, I'm missing two. Wait, hang on. Why, why am I missing the first one? <laughs> what an idiot. Okay, so we got, like, the Awakening. Where am I? An unfamiliar world. Tabatha Hills, Southeast Hebrew region. Actually, maybe I should just find the one around here. Zelda and Sonya. Let's see. Sonya is caught. Birth of the Demon King. The Sage's Vow. No. The King's Duty. Hang on. Like, what the fuck? Hang on. Okay, I'm nowhere near. Hang on. It's weird. Uh. Yeah, I, I guess it's a good thing I started looking them up because there's apparently there's no one. Uh, this is nowhere near where I need to be. No, actually, no. No. Oh, okay. This is exactly right. Okay. Okay, it's a little bit south. Okay, yeah, this is exactly right. Yeah, I, I always, I always felt guilty when like I um I looked at like shrine locations in the first game, but I suppose like if you're trying to get through it, like you're just trying to get all the shrines. There's no reason to like to cripple yourself, right? <laughs> Okay, uh, it's to the left, what the fuck? No, Link, no, hang on. Is there any thermals? It's a waterfall. I can swim up the waterfall. I, I don't understand why Link has the ability to go up waterfalls, like, quicker than he climb up mountains. That makes no sense. Like, is that how deep into Mifa's pussy you were? Like, shit. Okay, hang on. Like, she made the armor. So, specifically, so she could propose to him. So, <laughs> that has to be the actual explanation, right? I don't love how there's one in like the spiral island, which is amazing. It's literally called the Dragon's Tear, right? Okay, where are they? The fuck is that? Well, anyway. Uh... Okay. Yeah, we have like Silk Song, I think is definitely coming out this year. Uh, Ghost Trick. Raincoat, I think is coming out in June, which I'm really looking forward to. Like, I hate Danganronpa with a passion. <laughs> I mean, I hate Danganronpa, which means I'm a big fan of Danganronpa. But, uh,. Yeah, I, uh, I'm legit really excited for your, uh, Rain Code. I, I think it might be great. Uh, you know, emphasis on might. I mean, my thinking is that, like, 100% we need... Oh, again? Okay, here we go. I can't believe I walked right by it. What the fuck? Okay. How many of them are, like, built into the mountain like this? It's so weird.
So yeah, this is supposed to be number two, so you can actually watch them in order after this. I'm so confused about the chronology of this. Reach for my hand, I'll soar away. That Kid Rule song made me really realize that uh, 20 years from now, we might get a similar tribute video to uh, Edelgard on Hellsbro. Like, <laughs> maybe. About how she did nothing wrong. Uh, here we go. Uh, here we go. Don't tell me it's like built into the mountain or some shit. Uh, is there a new Samba? I um I don't know anything about Samba. Like I remember it being shilled by like Nintendo Power back in the day when I got a Wii one, but uh at the time like I had a burning seething hatred for Sega because like there was a guy on Nintendo Power's uh, team who was like a raging Sega fanboy. And, like, always gave these, like, shitty Sonic games, like, great scores. It was, like, my exposure to just how, like, ridiculous Sega fanboys could be. Like, it was weird to me that, like, people were still doing that in, like, 2008. I mean, this seems to be a dead thing now. Like, you know, maybe y Yakuza still has a following, but for, like, the most part. That feels like, it feels like something that, like, nobody actually does. Breath of the Wild. VNX is safe. Never need another game. Oh, Link. If I knew I didn't have it, I would probably assume I got this already. But it's so ridiculous how hard this is. Like, why can it not just be, like, a small... Ugh. Okay. Either this is meant to be hard, or, like... Either this is really hard, or I'm just an idiot. Alright, let's... A Mario game? Yeah, I think so, too. Like, we could legit get one out of nowhere. Like, if you look on, like, the eShop right now, you'll see a lot of the best-selling games on Mario games. Like, New Super Mario Bros. U and, like, 3D World are doing really well right now. So, yeah, I think, uh, I think now's a really good time to release a new Mario game. I think the Mario movie is for, um, it's on Amazon Prime now, actually. Yeah, we should do a we should do a watch party for that. Uh, I'll try and like figure out how that works, <laughs> but uh, I'll try setting up like a, a launch a watch a watch party for it. I did. Wait, the fuck? No, I didn't. That's bullshit. Like, wait, where did I come from? Down here? I have. Is it actually on the the guide? Or does it just give you the general location? No, it doesn't. Dragon map coordinates and location. Top center of the structure house. Wait, what? Top center? What structure? Wait, what, what's he talking about? Ha! <laughs> Notice I said he and not they. Because I'm not a fucking dipshit. Okay. Okay, uh... Okay, it's top of the structure. Okay? Here it is. Okay. Do we not have a physical release for the Mario movie yet? Is this still in theaters? Like, how much has it made? Like, I feel like it made a billion dollars and then people stopped talking about it. 
Because I was getting into like scary territory. Yeah, these chocolates are really good. As I thought. Oh, it's, it's the great the end of world I know. It looks the exact same. What are you talking about? So far back in the past, it's become legend. So it's true. This is really the era of Hyrule's founding. Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone and are able to manipulate time, then your story makes sense. Oh, I believed her right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, Babu. Oh no! I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. Oh, uh, I see. In any they wouldn't be related case, after that, like you had that said, length of time, you though. To return to your era as soon as you like, how far ago was this? Because, like, even within, like, a couple of generations, like, y y y it dilutes with, like, everyone else you, you end No. <laughs> like, nobody is related after that much time. You possibly could. Oh, but anyway. Dr. Stone goes into this. In my time, something terrible is happening. I need to get back there. But how do I do that? I don't even know how I got given the first place. Wait, what's he doing? What'd she do that for? Wait, what was that about? Now, Zelda, dear. You don't need to solve your problems all at once. Why not come back with us to the castle? Hmm? No, I... We'll tell everyone that you're a distant relative of ours. <laughs> It is true, after all. We'll get you fresh clothes, too. I'm sure I also will come to you. Wisdom takes time. Oh, <laughs> wisdom! I don't know what to say. She has the triforce of wisdom. Ah, I wonder. Minoru, she may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said? Yes. She knows far more than anyone about our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. We'll call on her. All right. Zelda. All right. Okay, unfamiliar world. Okay. Did I get all the early ones? Yeah, it looks like it's the later ones I didn't really get. Oh, wait, hang on. There's more than... How much more do I need? Okay, Zelda and Sonya. What's what's the next one? Uh, The one after Zelda and Sonya. Location. Sonya is caught by... Okay. Gogobi heals, curve, finance. And I get spoiled on what happened because of the name. Uh, Gogobi heals... Curved peninsula on the south of the Cluda Sea. Okay, so that's a pretty easy location. I mean, it would be if I'd ever gone down there, but all right. Yeah, I'm gonna play some Metroid Fusion. Uh for sure. Ah man, there's so much always so much to play. Oh, I love how you activate the tower and it immediately stops raining. Oh, holy crap. It took me way too long to figure out what the problem was. Cause like I tried burning the brambles, but like it wouldn't work. And I, I couldn't figure out why. And apparently what's what was happening was that the um the rain was so thick that it was putting out the fire, which didn't make any sense to me at all. 
Like, it wasn't that intense, bro. Like, I, I was getting, like, I was getting, like, uh, starting a fire. Like, I was, like, dropping in there, like, uh, you know, at light speed, like, firing a fire arrow and, like, or whatever, throwing a fire fruit, like, before the rain picks up, right? So, like, I, I thought I could just, no. It, you have to, like, do this thing where you block the rain. You have to build, like, an umbrella so you can burn the stuff. Like, it's so stupid. I, I have no idea what they were thinking with that. I still have not gotten a Lurlin. Or a Tino. Oh. Holy shit, Kino. It's been a while since we've been to a shrine, so... Uh, I think we should do that now before... Yeah, I gotta boost my stamina wheel, right? I'm kind of nervous about that. Like, getting a new power that I won't be able to use because of my stamina. Yeah, that's what I did, yeah. Yeah, that's what you were supposed to do. But, like, I was a complete dumbass. I couldn't figure it out. I had to look it up. <sighs> like, I couldn't do it right because I'm, I'm terrible at building things. Oh, no! Oh, it's a... Outside equipment is beyond... Why don't you just give me the power? Why do I need to... Flow. All right. It's so weird not seeing Guardians. Constructs are so weird because they're nowhere near as interesting as the Guardians are. Like, you get the impression that, like, the Guardians would, like, rape the shit out of, like, these, uh, the Zonai tech. Like, we haven't seen anything crazy from the Zonai yet. Like, I think the Sheikah were more advanced. Like, they had to have been, right? I love that they use the term constructs, by the way, because, uh, Belladonna in Jaw the Dragon is a construct. And we got, oops. I use the term as well, but it means something completely different. <laughs> uh, okay. What am I supposed to do? How am I? Okay, hang on. Uh. L. Are you talk are you talking about the same sky tower? Because I, I don't I think you you have to burn like the brambles. Because I I was not able to glide over them. The ones I'm talking about. Like you'll see them like elsewhere. They're like there was a shrine I couldn't get into because they were covered by brambles. There we go. Is that what they're called? Brambles? That's what I that's what I That's what I thought they were called. Fuck. I might be making that up, honestly. I, I guess I could look it up. Is brambles a word or am I just bullshitting? Uh brambles. A prickly scrambling vine or shrub. Yeah, that's exactly what I was talking about. Especially a blackberry or other wild shrub of the rose family. Yeah, that's exactly what I was talking about. Weird. Okay, yeah, it is a weird word. It is a word. Ugh. I love how you, like, made me doubt myself for a second. I'm just like, wait a minute. Did I, am I bullshitting? But, like, no. I am typically, like, know what I'm talking about when it comes to word. I am a, I am a writer, after all. Uh, here we go. But, all right. How did 
they get me? Okay. Hang on. Solid snake. Oh, come on. Can I not just... Can I use fuse? I can. Okay. I keep forgetting to use fuse. It just... It just never dawns on me to try it. Yeah, so I don't have a bow. I don't have anything. I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to do. Uh, okay. This okay. Yeah, I have arrows but no bows. Yeah, I guess that's what I have to do is just like Finally got a bow. Okay. Uh, hang on. Do I have any materials? Shock group. Bitch. Got him. Like a boss. Okay. Okay. I missed. Fuck. I killed him though. Okay. I love how you have to like improvise sometimes. Like I have no idea how you're supposed to do it, but it doesn't feel right at all. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I ate that. Do I have any shock group? Uh, Zenite charge. Oh, oh fuck. And I might have dropped down from above. Damn it, didn't knock him in the water. Okay. Got him. So satisfying. With the Yiga based? Considering they're Team Rocket, I'm gonna say no. <laughs> There's no way that she the Yiga would bait. Like, the Sheikah are based, but the Yiga are not. Like, the... Yeah, what's the lore behind the Yiga? They just serve Ganondorf, right? Yeah, I've seen one Yiga. They are, they are a lot less common in this game. Like, are they only in the underground? I mean, I love the Yiga, so it's, it's like, weird they got rid of them. Or that they're not as common. They're everywhere in the in uh, Breath of the Wild. Okay. Great. 
Brilliant Diamond. Uh, yeah, my favorite's probably... I legit think Scarlet might be my favorite. Oh. No, Legends of Arceus, yeah, for sure. I'm, like, talking about Scarlet. Legends of Arceus might be one of the best Pokemon games I've ever played, honestly. Like, it really is that good. I fucking love Pokemon, man. I spent, like, the past several nights just playing this fucking game. Like, it's insane. And, like, we're nowhere near the end. We still gotta beat, like... Damn, why do I not have... Oh, here we are at Lurlin. Okay, interesting. Okay, we might be able to get, like, uh, some pirates. Some pirate gear. What the fuck? What... <laughs> Were there wells in Breath of the Wild? All right, here we go. I don't think there were. Why do I not have better... Oh, no, we're fighting the occupiers. Shit. Oh, no. You have to clear them out? Fucking really? That is weird. Okay, that was unexpected. Great. I was not, like, looking to get into a fight like this. Especially since there's, like... I think typically when you get, get into a raid, you're supposed to have, like, your guys with you. And I don't think they're here. So they fucked up, Lurlin. Wow. I was hoping that, like, it would be One Piece Pirates we had to go up against. But... Yeah, just regular monsters. I don't have any anything I can use to... All my weapons are shit, and I haven't been able to find anything good for a long time. My bows are good, but that's like one thing. Here we go. <laughs> Base. Okay. Like, it doesn't really do a whole lot. Like, it gives them, makes them wide open, but I'd rather just keep attacking. This thing is so strong. Ah, okay. That's a gun? Wait, hang on. I didn't know it could do that. Oh, hang on. I'm not even close to winning. I got a statue? Uh... Yeah, I think maybe if I had gotten, like, a, a heart, I might have been able to refill my HP.
Okay. Is that that asshole with like armor? No. Okay. Oh, some fish. I could probably just pick that. Heal using Nick. Okay, let's eat. Alright. Yeah, PS2 graphics for sure. I am complete. Oh, I have a fish in that Okay. Assholes, they still have to be. I got the club. I can't even use anything because. Oh, hang on. Yeah, I'm gonna try. There we go. Stone axe, yeah, I'll keep that. Okay. That's a really good shield. Holy crap. What happens when you clear them out? Like I, I was, I've been anxious to go to Lurland Village since I heard it was occupied by pirates, but uh, this is like completely unexpected. <laughs> I got sidetracked. Like I'm not supposed to be doing this. All right, uh, arrows. How many of them are there? Okay. That yeah, might have been, like, the bulk of their forces. Well, I mean, we still have, like, so many... Okay, here we go. Why can't I climb up? Okay. Yeah, Lurland Lur Lur Village, uh... There wasn't a lot of interesting aspects to it. In the original, so I'm glad they did something with it here. Ah, shit, no! Uh, do I need food? Fuck. I hate these slow clubs. Like, I would never use them if, like, I didn't just... If I had, like, a choice. Like, I always get in these situations where I can't, like... Ugh. How the fuck does he keep running? Like, I... Uh... Okay. Yeah, we, we can't do this now. Uh, I, I don't have the weapons for it. Like, I just don't. Like, I've been looking for weapons forever so I could beat the boss. Like, for Riju, but no. Uh, I haven't found shit. Okay. Uh, where is the... So where was I going? This is where, yeah. Yeah, I have like one spear and like a, a completely worthless like air gust thing. Like, ugh, damn it. Those bananas? Oh, I'm surprised there are no Yiga around here. Yeah, why don't the Yiga just live in the by the beach if they, they want love bananas so much? Why do they love bananas so much? Did we ever get an explanation? That's such a weird like thing. Okay. Like I I love the Yiga, but like ugh, nothing about the makes any sense. Okay. Um How many more do we have after this? Three? 
Yeah, three, okay. Can I eat chakra? Oh, wait, do we have new Yu Gi Oh! What the fuck is this douchebag doing? <laughs> what is this doing? Oh, he has a sword. Okay, that's what I need. Like, everything I fight see, tends to have bows. And, like, I just. That's not what I'm interested in. I want, I want like, swords and weapons and stuff like that. Strengthen was all bow. They both had bows? Why does everyone have bows? I don't need bows. I don't need to get shot by one. Okay. I think we're gonna go back to the shrine and just like fly down there. I think it'll be quicker than walking. Yeah, these uh these gourmet sweets are amazing. Alright. What was this thing? Oh, that is really good. I'm not even sure if we'll eat all that. I wasn't expecting it to be one giant, like, block of... I don't think I have to freeze it for now. That is really good, though. I think I have too much sugar, but... It was good stuff. I'll have to check the prices for that, because I don't remember how expensive that was. Because it was kind of small, but it was really good.
Yeah, it's kind of ridiculous how, how like, little of the lore I remember from Breath of the Wild. Like, I didn't care about Breath of the Wild story much, so... <laughs> so, like, it, it's kind of interesting seeing that, like, how, how they put so much thought into, like, stuff like the Zanai and stuff like that. Um... Yeah. That thing was really rich. Yeah, I'm definitely a little bit, like, hungry for real, too. I wasn't expecting it to be that fucking big, oof. I hope it's still good by the time I get back to it. Yeah, I think I'll probably stream again, like, next week, too. Uh, to tomorrow as well. Uh, probably not Saturday night, but... I'd like to finish the game. I really would. And I, I just don't think we're anywhere near where we need to be. Yeah, I know, right? Well, you don't see a lot of the world in Skyward Sword. Like, there has to be some kind of, like, magma civ civilization and, like, uh, you know, the Gorons. We don't even, like, the Gorons just kind of exist, you know? Like, there's all these weird, like, species in Skyward Sword that never, like, appear again. So, I don't know. There's, there's a lot of weird things in Skyward Sword. Like, I, I could see, like, the Zonai just existing, like, somewhere. Middle, hang on. The middle of what? Like it's on the map, isn't it? Like I should just look at the map. Ugh. That's what that's not in the middle, that's like up near the top. Okay, hang on. Yeah, I'm nowhere near. Okay, hang on. Oops, yeah, I sent it at the sky. Do you get better versions of these powers? Because I always feel like Ascend in particular is, like, really limited. Recall as well. Like, you can't go back into the sky with uh, a lot of these fallen objects with recall, because it, like, doesn't last long enough. Okay, I think it's up here somewhere. Hmm. I hope I don't get sick from eating that. Ugh. That was weirdly rich. Is that a boat? We can make a boat! Oh no! Eat your heart out, Kyrie! Look how easy it is to make a fucking raft. Oops, hang on. Uh. Okay. Uh. Am I sure it's up here? There it is. Yep, right there. Two more to go after this, and we'll we'll get to see the totally awesome thing that I won't be able to use because I don't have enough stamina to get wheel. I guess I could just like um, sacrifice my HP to get like the extra wheel I need. I mean, I was putting like all of my all my things into HP because I don't see a point in having a ton of stamina. Seeing a lot of Sonya lately. Right, Zelda. We are alone, as you requested. Oh what no. Was it you wanted to discuss with me in private? Oh no. Is this wrong? You're Wait. Far too trusting. <laughs> oh no. What? Oh my. I'm surprised to hear you say such a thing. <laughs> oh no. That is quite out of character for the Zelda I know. But then you. 
I'm a puppet of Ganondorf. No. Did you really think we hadn't realized your deceit? Wait, what? <laughs> What's happening? Huh? <laughs> What's going on? I like her now. Okay. Okay. Oh no, don't tell me she got Sephiroth! Wait. That's legit the same position and everything! Did he do the exact same thing? What? No! glad we took the time to do this um yeah i've been putting this off for way too long i mean i wasn't even putting it off like i have so many other things to do in the game like okay uh birth of the demon king okay birth of the demon king okay peninsula peninsula south of lana Rusi. okay i think it's up here right No, it's north of Lanaro, so. Yeah, I think it's over this way. Ah, fuck. Hello. The plot is actually pretty good. I'm really invested. Like, I, I just think the problem... Everything is so spaced out, and it's a lot of order. It's just... Ugh. I mean, I'm using a guide, and I think that's probably the ideal way to do it, to be honest with you. Like, I can't imagine, like, unlocking all this shit the normal way, the way you're supposed to. Do you ever get depressed to like Nintendo things? Ah... Uh... No. Uh, like, whenever I got, like, embarrassed at liking Nintendo things, it was because of, like, other people, like, insisting that, like, it was ruining my life or some shit. Like, my mom used to do that all the time. Uh, people I know used to do that all the time. Uh, that's something that, like, I, I, I very strongly feel isn't actually true. So yeah, I've never, I've never played Nintendo for my problems. I haven't. What's with that, that, that narrative that like Godwinson has, that like, oh, Nintendo fans, they don't play anything for their consoles. Like, yeah, I do. Like I used to, like I, I own a PlayStation. Like the reason I don't play on PlayStation is because it sucks. What the fuck is that? Is that a spiral? Oh, hang on. What the fuck is that? I'm surprised you can't, like, fly everywhere around the map. There it is. Okay. Yeah, we have a target. Damn, I'm nowhere close. A little bit further. Come on. Come on, Link. Okay, I think I'm gonna get caught. Come on, come on, come on. No! Okay, got it. Okay, wait. 
Where the hell am I? Am I in Zora's domain? No. What the fuck am I? Okay, it's a Zora's structure, but... Okay, I think I just have to get, get over this hill and I'm good. Yeah, that's what most people do. Yeah, I'm glad I used a guide for this. There's no reason to, like, stick around. Like, I guess if you're playing the game normal, you'll just come across these things, but... I'm kind of speedrunning this. Not really, but kind of. Like God of War. Yeah, I saw him bitching about like games on Switch like not looking pretty enough, and it's just such a laughable concept. Like I, I do think we're in a we're in a post like graphical, oops, uh, a post like graphic war account, uh, industry now, because like we're seeing games like this that aren't like pseudo realistic doing really really well. Like, if anything, I think, like, becoming overly realist realistic is becoming, like, a, a boat anchor around a lot of games. It's not, like, a... It's not necessarily a positive anymore. Wings on the wind. Oh, yeah, I think this is a vehicle one. I, I love these. I wish there was more of them. Okay. Uh... Okay. So where did the second Zelda come from? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Hang on. Like, we never saw any, like, Zelda, any other Zelda, right? Well, like, in the flashbacks. Back here, you? Oh, here you go. Go. Oh, fuck. Hey, did you? Okay, uh. Yeah, I've seen some pretty crazy, like, uh. Winged areas so far, so this seems pretty basic. It's weird whenever you, like. Go to a, a shrine you were supposed to do earlier, and you find it's just not all that hard compared to some of the ones you've already done. Like, there are some crazy shrines in this. Oh, hang on, oops. Oh, fuck. No! No! I can I use- Oh, I, I can use Ascend! Okay. Remember when Zelda lifetime sales would be three, four million? Yeah, I do remember that. Like, yeah. <laughs> that was like, that happened, uh, you know, with Skyward Sword. Skyward Sword was like weirdly damage controlled. Like, very weirdly. I don't know, like, I feel like people believed, like, the stereotypes about Zelda back in the day. About how it was for kids and how it wasn't evolving. Like, I don't really see that anymore. When people try to tell you there are games better than it, it just becomes laughable. Because it's just not true. Uh, can I attach two of these things together? Or what exactly am I trying to do? Yeah, I think I'm just gonna, like, just get under it and then just ascend. Because I'm a lazy fuck and I'm...
I don't think that's what you're supposed to do, but whatever. Fuck you, game. Well, we, we have a Nintendo God of War game. We have Bayonetta. It's the same thing, but better. Like, what exactly does God of War do that Bayonetta doesn't do better? Yeah, I think Zelda was a, as a franchise, was really downplayed for a long time. Um, because of, like, the PlayStation thing, and now it's kind of taken its place as like the the king of open world fantasy i mean it, it always was really but like i think there was like an argument that was made that uh that there were other games doing what zelda does better and that's it's no longer even debatable like there, there's nothing that even comes close like nothing nothing does what zelda does nothing yeah i could probably get three more shrines real quick uh, get the stamina wheel, and then like, hmm. we'll see. We'll, we'll get the prize. We'll uh, we'll get all the tri all the tiers, and then. How well did Advance Wars do? Like, it feels like people stopped talking about it because it came out like right before this. I myself haven't played it in a couple of weeks. Like, it, that's because I haven't had time and I've been busy. But like, and playing this, but like, yeah. You, I've been playing this for, like, hours every night. It's so ridiculous. Like, I legit think that after my vacation, like, I'll be playing this, like, every weekend for a while. I mean, I, I've, um, I've gotten through, like, the worst of it, so I think I just need to, holy crap, I just walked up to it. Why are some of them so obnoxious, and other ones are just right there? Like, I just walked up to it. I wasn't even, like, thinking about looking for it at that point, but it was there. Okay. King Baldry. We just received word that the last free village in the Gerudo Desert has fallen. Free village? <laughs> Wait, as, a, as opposed to like one? How did they have more villages back then than they do now? Like that. Our only hope is for me to defeat the Demon King. Are there villages we just don't see here? He is not someone you can stop by yourself. You are not alone. You have the Gerudo, Goron, Zora, and Riku leaders, as well as Zelda. What's with these stupid masks they're wearing? And of course, you can count on me. There's something I'd like to show you. Why was Minoru not brought up? Like, uh, did she not show up at the final battle? Why? Oh wait, don't tell me. Is that? No, hang on. I saw the doors and I'm just like, wait, is is Zelda like asleep back there? How many times has this bitch gone back in time and been sealed away? Okay. Like she did that in Skyward Sword. Okay. Stand with me. I need all your aid. Okay, these are the secret stones. Okay. I thought he was gonna open the door and it was gonna be like Zelda back there. I <laughs> thought she was in Skyward Sword. <laughs> like I was just like, ugh. This raises so many questions. The sister is furry bait. Is she like? How do furries? Ugh. I don't. I don't know. I'm, I'm glad I don't know anything about furry culture, but I'd like to know something about Gerudo culture. If you catch my grip. 
<laughs> well, my drift. I'm only talking about drift. Ah. Okay. We all gather here. Swear on our lives to serve Robin, the king of night. Alright. So we have like the why are there only six stages? Like there there were seven in Ocarina. Like who's missing? Like I guess we don't have like a Shadow Sage equivalent. There's no Sheikah in the distant past, interestingly. So what are the Sheikah just Ugh. The Sheikah is such a big part of the calamity, it's weird to think they don't have a role in the the distant past, but okay. Okay. A king's duty. Okay, a master sword in time. Wait, what? North of Great Hyrule Forests. Okay. Uh, where the fuck is the Great Hyrule Forest? Ah, oh, here it is. Oh, that's where uh, that's where the Deku Tree is. I still have not gone there. <laughs> At the bottom of the master sword, the tip of the blade. No, wait, did I get... I didn't get that? Really? <clears throat> hey, don't give me... Hey, man! Crystal is doing stuff, like, with... Outside of, a, of an NDA. Like, she's just a stupid bitch. Ugh. Don't even get me started on Crystal. I'm so mad about that. Like, I... I legit do not want to see Crystal, like, appear in official... And an official Star Fox product ever again. Just because she's so popular with furries. Like, that's the only reason why. Uh. I don't know. I, I, I've really started. I, I've been shitting on furries for a while now. But, like, I've. I really don't like them. Okay, it's this way. I don't see anything. With our powers combined, I am Captain Planet. Hang on, is that it? Where the fuck am I? Where am I going? Okay. Is this the right way? I don't see it. I love how we're just ignoring all the markers that I have set. <laughs> like, I have no idea what any of them... What any of them are for. Probably just, like, a bunch of shrines I've seen, like, around and that I just haven't gotten. Like, there's so much shit to do. Yeah, it should be around here, like... Huh? Okay. Glyph location, north of Great Hyrule Fort. It looks right. Hang on. Yeah, I can see the bend in the path. Like, I'm, I'm right here. I'm right on top of it. Oh, no, I think I went a little too far. Backtrack. Is that it? No, those are ruins. I think it's the... No, it's not the forest. There's the chasm. Okay, there's the bend in the, in the road. Yeah, I should be right on top of it. I... But I don't see it anywhere. Oops, I ran out of... Okay. <sighs> Why do I get the impression this is going to be an obnoxious one? <laughs> the fuck? He's riding on a bear! <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell is this goofy shit? <laughs> I have no weapon. What? A little more. Uh. 
Yeah, I didn't see it. I, I legit was looking around everywhere. I'm not that far off from the tower either. Northwest? No, wait, no. Hang on. Yeah, that, that looks wrong. It looks like more this direction. Even the guide isn't helping me because they didn't mention all the mountains and how you can't see shit. Okay. I guess I could just go keep like jumping down through Sky uh, Skyview that tower. But uh I don't think I'm that far. Okay, where, where the hell is it? Uh, yeah, it looks like a little bit more south. I guess we'll look at this peak and see if we can find it. North of Great Hyrule Forest. Yeah, yeah, I'm right there. Yeah, I should, like, be seeing it. I, I don't know. I'm facing the right direction. All right. Okay. Here it is. Okay. So it's at the. You say the bottom of the sword. So does that mean the? Does that mean the hilt or the blade? I'm pretty sure it was the tip. If I'm remembering correctly. Yeah, I thought so. All right, last one. All right, let's see what this. Uh... Well, there are more memories in like the guide, so I don't. I don't know. Like, do you get more after you get them all, or? That dragon loves like, <laughs> loves loves being in in like the middle of cutscene shots. Look at that. Every single fucking time. That happens to me like that's happened to me several times. You managed to restrain me somehow. Like a beast. It's Link. I am not sure you'll be able to stop him. <laughs> yeah, he's really fucking strong. Zelda. Yeah, we saw this at the beginning of the game, I remember. Where, like, he sends the Master Sword back. How exactly does this work? Oh, 
It's just so good. Oh no, it's fight! We're seeing fight! You're telling me that thing is safe? Oh man. Does Zelda even know? Okay. Please, Zelda, plug me in. <laughs> plug. Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. It has to mean something. Yes. I know why I am here. It's something only I can do. We will finally stop him. <laughs> to become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. I will forever change. So she's gonna turn into a dragon? The fuck? Hell yeah. But you're in the past. What the? Okay, whatever. All this talk of dragons makes me think about a different franchise. Remember when dragons weren't all that relevant? And now they seem to be a critical, critical aspect of the plot? Okay. 100% Skyward Sword is to become like Dragon Central. Oh, come on, another one? Oh, wait, wait. wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. Yeah, I know where that is. Yeah, we've seen that. Yeah, that, that, like, uh, that outcropping of rock was always looked kind of weird to me. What the fuck was that? Well, anyway, uh, okay, so that was, so did Zelda become a fucking dragon? So she, ah. So who are these other dragons, then? They're all named after, like, Din, Nehru, and Pharaoh, so did the goddesses just become fucking dragons? <sighs> yeah, the spiral. Okay. Enough with the fucking spirals, okay? Like, I already talked about Uzumaki once. I don't need to bring it up again. Like, whenever you see a spiral shape, just get... Just get frightened because some Uzumaki shit is about to go down. Like, what, what would happen if this was taking place in the Uzumaki universe? Would, like, there be some, like, weird, like, I don't know, time warp thing? I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know! Like, it's impossible. They come up with the shit they came up with in Uzumaki. Ah. Ooh. I can't even remember all of it. Like, it's... Some of it is so out there, it becomes, like, ridiculous. Like, the whole hair thing and, like, the snails, like, the, the mushrooms. Like, ugh. Oh, is that Terrytown? Yeah, I haven't gone over there yet. Oh, hang on. Yeah, Terrytown's in the area, isn't it? Hang on, I'm gonna 
uh, switch to Zora on her and just roll her there. Because fuck you, that's why. Uh, I forget how much, like, swimming fucking sucks in this game. It's so weird how, like, how terrible Link is at swimming in this. That better be, like, the improvement that, like, uh, the next one does. Like, better swimming mechanics. I can't believe they, like, added in skydiving before swimming. Oh, hang on. I see a... I see a shrine back there. Oh, what? damn it! Fuck! Wait, is this where I was supposed to go, or...? I think the tier was, like, right behind me. Oh, well, we'll, we'll, we'll do this first. Turbine power. So, wind? Fuck. Okay. Oh, gee, I wonder what I'm supposed to do here. Okay, hang on. It's not right. Well, like, you idiot. That's not how it goes. All right. Okay, attach that. Uh. I missed the electric weapons. It feels like. They got rid of all the elemental weapons in this game, huh? Like, and you're supposed to just dick around with, like, fusions and stuff. It's just, it's just weird. What the hell is all this? Uh... uh let's see here. Ooh. I have this thing, but I don't, I don't think it's going to work. <laughs> No, it doesn't even begin to work. What the fuck? Uh, well, first things first. I need to get this thing to connect to that thing. And I think we're going to take this metal thing and... Yep. That's... Yeah, that's how electricity works. I hope this game doesn't give you, like... It doesn't give kids, like, a incorrect like <laughs> view on how like this kind of thing is supposed to work it's so like outlandish okay so we have like this fireball okay did i burn my thing oh wow now i have no weapons wow that is uh that is bizarre Hang on, I think... stay on there okay so what's with this faucet like what why does it go off am i supposed to get them like all the blow what I'm doing. <sighs> I want to go home. I think I'm about ready to take a break. I will play something else. Uh, let's see here. I don't know what I'm doing. Holy crap, what is with these shields? Okay. What, do you, what would you do with like a 50 year Okay, whatever. Um. Yeah, how do I open this gate? Oh. Oh. 
Oh, uh, hey, okay. So you're supposed to light it. Okay. You have to do it in a certain order, or what? Fan? The f really? Oh, wow, that's awesome. Holy crap! What the fuck was that? That was crazy. Okay, uh... I must not have, like, attached it well enough. Why is it? Okay. Why does it keep like careening off? Was it like unbalanced? That was crazy. Wow. I'm a journalist. All right. All right, here we go. So these are the cures the kingdom. Okay. Let's see what this is. All right. So Zelda was the kingdom all along. I thought she was the princess. Ah, <laughs> oh, okay. I can't believe we still haven't fought that thing for Ryuji. What's that? The sword that seals the darkness. The blade that shatters so easily against my power cannot save you from me. The sword will continue to gain strength if bathed in sacred power. The stronger that power, the more powerful the sword becomes. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon, one blessed with eternal life. Counting on you. The hell? Link, why will you restore? The Master Sword to you. I will care for it until the time comes. I will pour my sacred power into it as a real evil weapon that defeats the Demon King. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. Ah, 
down. I see a shrine in the background. What's the deal with that? Okay. No. Link. Link. Protect them all. Oh. Holy crap. We didn't see her in the first game, though, right? And then, who are the other dragons? I, uh, okay. Okay. Are those silent princesses? <laughs> Hilarious. Well, at least we know where Zelda is. So what, does she legit die? Like, uh, no, no, she goes back in time. Okay. Okay. Silent print, yep, I knew it. Yeah, we're picking them all. So what do I do now? Is that, is that all I needed? There's still a couple gaps, though. What's the deal with that? No, oh, anyway. Uh... But I, I didn't get anything, though. White dragon. Am I supposed to follow her or what? Don't have any don't have any weapons? Ugh. Uh I, I guess? <laughs> What's the comp uh, compendium say about it? Let's see, light dragon. Ah. That's the final, ah, uh, final monster. I guess we should, uh, alright, sure. 
Yeah, I do want to... Okay. Land on her head? Wait, fucking what? How am I going to do that? Alright, whatever. Ah. Like, how am I going to do that? Alright. How are you going to get up there? I mean, she's going to be difficult to find again, too. On top of that. Uh, okay, I should probably just go do... Riju first. I mean, I would love to if I had a single weapon. Like, I haven't found shit. Like, I've been wandering around forever. Alright, uh... I've been, I've been wandering around forever trying to figure this out. And I can't find anything. Like, <sighs> One more piece of stamina, and then I'll land on her head. Yeah, I should probably start doing shrines again. It's been a it's been a while. I think I might just do a bunch of shrines and like collect the weapons I get in them. Um The best weapon. Oh really? Okay, excellent. So yeah, she has the master sword, so. I like how they don't make it obvious that you can do that. Oh, at least we know who Zelda is. And, like, why doesn't Link tell anyone else, like, what's going on? Like, he doesn't explain to these people about the sages or, like, the shrines or, like, the history of the world or the Zanai or any of this shit. Like, we've uncovered so much crazy shit and he doesn't explain it to anyone. Like, why is he... Why are we not going back to Para to, like, explain to her, like, what happened to Zelda? Like, ugh. From an optical perspective, I like it. It's uh, it's charming. Zelda's based, but I don't know. Zelda's always been based. What the hell is this? Wait. The spring? What the fuck? Uh, can I pull it down or? is this? Wait, hang on. It's a spring, but why is it not springing? Hang on, how does this work? Uh... Do I need to, like, land on top of it or some shit? Okay. like move it like closer to the thing so I can just land on top of it. Uh... Oh, oh what the fuck? Oh man. <laughs> what was with that dive? Shit. Okay, I was just like, okay, we gotta fall as fast as possible and then I do that. That's embarrassing. Linky like link 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 it doesn't work. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, I have... Can I fuse? Well, I don't have anything to fuse it with. work. 
is it not? It's a spring, right? Why is it not springing? Uh, okay, so I have ascend, Alder hand fuse recall. Maybe I should flip it upside down. I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to do here. I need to break it apart now. Fusion. Recall map ascend. Fusion, recall, map ascend. Fusion, recall. What is the shrine called? A bouncy device. Well, it's supposed if it's supposed to be bouncy, why is it not bouncing? Like, what the what's the deal? Like, I'm having more luck with that thing back there. Recall, send, ultra hand. Like, it's so obvious what you're supposed to do, but like. Jaff super chat. <laughs> what does Jaff have to do with okay? Uh fuck it. Okay. Really? Yeah, that's absurd. What am I doing? Go home and just, all right. What is going on? A bouncy device. How do you bounce? Like, okay, what can I all do? I have. Hmm. I get the impression that like I'm making myself look like a complete retard. Like I get the impression this is one of those instances where I'm just like it, it's not that hard. Okay. Uh, did I try jumping up and down on it? Did I try hitting it? Oh! I didn't try hitting... Oh, I can't hit it because I don't have a weapon. Oh, that's probably it. Okay, let's fire an arrow at it and see if that works. Yeah, okay. Well, then why do you have to activate it? It doesn't make any sense. Yep, got it. Okay. You gotta be kidding me, but I don't have anything else. Like, I just have this bow and arrow. What 
just gonna make it okay. Wait. But, but I wanted to get the. Ah, okay. This is embarrassing. Wait, hang on. Oops. Okay, hang on. I can't believe I don't have a single like physical weapon to hit this thing with. Like, what the hell am I? T He deserved everything bad that happened to him after Dread. Like, he absolutely 100% did. Like, okay, okay, we're gonna go over this way. Okay, I see. I wanna play some Zeno. Okay. A disco ball. Okay. Eh. I love you. Ah, damn it. I'm glad I'm not around those people anymore. Okay. Do I have to launch it back this way, or do I... <sighs> I love you. Okay. seem to work. I don't know why it's like <laughs> off balance, but I got over there. Got him. Shuck him. Oh, it's a bigger one. Oh, they're like stapled together. What, <laughs> what the hell? That would work? That works. Really? This is what the game wants me to do. Oh, be a weapon. I, I'm sick of not having one. Holy crap. No. Okay. Okay, get this. So we're gonna have to staple, like, another one on top of it. Like, what the fuck? Like, how autistic is this? Oops. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, because not all of them were... Ah... Uh... Okay, I think. There we go. Don't tell me I'm gonna have to detach it so I can fix it. Okay, got it. I have too many bows, so I'm actually glad I'm getting to the bows, but. Where are the melee weapons? Why does nothing have melee weapons? Okay, uh. Oops, I'm You have to staple them together. I call it stapling, but it's not. It's okay. We Miyamoto's heyday is still going strong. The guy just put out a, a movie that made a billion dollars. Like, how the fuck can you look at that and try to say that like Miyamoto is past his prime? That's, like, fucking stupid. All 
Okay. Okay. Uh, how was I even doing? Okay. Uh, oh, that's right. I was. Yeah, that's right. I'm doing. I'm doing all the. All the shrines I completely neglected to do. Yeah, all I need is a weapon, right? So I, I guess I could just get the the stamina wheel, get on top of Zelda. <laughs> get on top of Zelda. What the fuck? Like, how old is she now? She's, like, 16 in Breath of the Wild. Well, she was in the Age of Calamity. She's technically, like, 100 years old. Like, <laughs> by the end of Breath of the Wild. And she hasn't aged at all, somehow. Like, she looks pretty good for 116. Uh, but, like... Yeah, um... And now she's, like, what? Like, a million years old? Like, what the fuck is with... What the fuck is with this chick? Okay, uh... Like, how, how old is she, like, realistically? Like, we know she has to be, like, over 10,000 years old. Like, with the, with the dragon thing, and... Like... like... Do we actually get, like, an actual date as, like, when... When the high... When the Kingdom of Hyrule was founded. Because I have no fucking idea. Like, it's so confusing. Like... <sighs> okay, where the hell am I going? Oh, did I go past it? Oh, is it on a Sky Island? It might be. That might explain my... Complete failure to. Yeah, it's like supposedly right there, but I don't see it. Like, what the fuck is it like gesturing towards? There's nothing here. Right? There's one over there, but. I don't see anything here. How long have I been playing? It's been... Every time I pop this game in, it feels like I, I play for like five, six hours at least. She's immortal. Yeah. It's been so long since I played Uprising. They need to port that up to Switch. Like, I hope it happens. Like, I, I 100% hope, hope we get, like, Kid Icarus Kid up HD, we get some new content, and we get to see, like, Jim Sterling just seethe once that game gets, like, the, the critical praise it always deserves. Like, even today, like, Jim Sterling will, like, stand by that, like, ridiculous... That ridiculous, like, uh, what was it, like a 5 out of 10 he gave the game? Like, he'll he'll still try to tell you the game is shit. Like, I think Kid Icarus Uprising is probably going to be, like, the Nintendo game that actually gets re-released and becomes, like, very successful. Like, I legit think it's going to happen. I think it's going to be, like, the poster child to, like, for games like that. Because uh, I think, I think, um... I think it's very difficult. It'll be very difficult to write off Nintendo games the way you used to. Uh, who knows? I think, uh, I don't think Jim Sterling is going to be able to, like, outplay it this time. So it'll be interesting, uh, seeing that happen. Like, th these guys weren't able to downplay Skyward Sword, which also got shit on, so. Uh, I I'm really interested in seeing, like, how, how Kid is Kid Icarus Uprising H HD does. I don't know, all the re-releases of Xenoblade did fine, so. I think, like, Xenoblade Chronicles 3D didn't they need to exist.
It's weird how Xenoblade just came out of nowhere and became a major Nintendo IP. Like, among its audience, it's, like, a big deal. I don't care about Xenoblade at all, but... Like, Zelda's so much better than Xenoblade. Like, why would I ever... Uh... I don't know, like, I noticed Xenoblade fans, like, have, like, these really fun, like, fan culture that I really envy. It feels like Xenoblade, like, is so relatively new that, like, the fan base for it isn't toxic at all. Like, I have noticed that. Like, it does come off as if, uh... You know, that audience, like, actually likes the games. Like, there's very little, like, Xenoblade-related pretendoism. Like, typically, if people are bitching about Xenoblade, it's just because of, like, the endless sequels or, or what have you. Or RGT saying they can make, like, another game. Yeah, I definitely think I should get the Master Sword. I would like to beat... Riju, but Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, Oblivion, uh, the, that's uh, that's DSD schedule. R.I.P. The Dick Show. YouTube's done what Maddox never could. What's happened? If you guys don't know, uh, my good friend, compatriot, and homie, homosexual, Dick Masterson, uh, had his channel yeeted. <laughs> oh man! Oh man! Supporting pedophiles like didn't man account for you like. Went out for a dead homie. To the dick show. The most false advertising I've ever seen, because not a single penis exists in that recording studio or on any videos they've ever done. What the fuck, Nick? Rest in peace, sweet prince. I love how the first comment I see is "Diddler Dax will not be missed." I, uh, I, 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 I'm inclined to agree. Fuck Dax. YouTube is done with Maddie. Never good. The speculation on the removal of the Dick Show. The speculation is that it has to do with Tess Holiday, who's so fucking fat she's in every chat room that exists. And apparently, she was bullied by the dick show, despite the fact that you cannot bully Tess Holiday with a fucking battering ram. It's impossible. There's too much ablative plating on that thing to, to get past. You, like, you can't damage it. It's like the blob in X-Men. Nothing moves. The fuck? Okay. I'm sure there was, like, a more... I'm sure I'm sure Dick didn't do it did something he wasn't supposed to be doing. There aren't a lot of combat shrines in this game. I'm still getting tutorials like this? Wow. Yeah, that is true. I have been noticing that, yeah. I don't know who's all, like, rallying against, um, Tears of the Kingdom, but, oops. <laughs> oops. Was this a shrine I was supposed to get, like, way early on? Nick is not funny. I agree! Like, that motherfucker has never made me laugh. Like, never. Even when I liked him, I'm just like, yeah, this is cringy. Nick is like, oh, he's like, well... He's like a tryhard. Like, he's an edgelord. Like, shit. He's 40. Like, ah. Uh. Like, I couldn't even watch the clip. I, I, was, I It was so unfunny. Oh, did I actually get weapons? Holy shit, I actually got a weapon. I don't know, did you see that, like, clip I posted on my channel the other day? Like, a, like Nick's racist Donkey Kong joke? <laughs> that was, like, it was so, like, un it was so, like, cringy and awkward that, like, even, like, the people he was with didn't think it was funny. But they had to, like, pretend because it's Nick Ricada. When he says a joke, you fucking laugh. Like, it's, uh, hang on, did I not? I love the flame emitter shields, but I never.
I feel like the shrines in this game aren't nearly as good as the ones in Breath of the Wild. Maybe it's just my opinion, but... There were some crazy shrines in Breath of the Wild. Like the one where you have to go to outside and look at the constellations. Holy crap, I actually got a couple of, uh... I'm pretty sure that's just the, uh... Well, I actually have a couple of pins lying around now. Holy shit. It only took me a couple of minutes, but I finally... Finally found the time to, like, get some spare pins. There's so much going on in this game. I think I got it. Um... Okay, I think that's two full bars. Okay. That should be good. So now I gotta find the dragon. Where the fuck is the dragon, though? Like, if I go back, I'm not gonna see her again, right? Why did I climb out of the hole to go to teleport away? Did I lose the fucking dragon? Where is she? So do I have to track her down now? Damn it! Alright, this is embarrassing. Are we just gonna wander around until we see her? Yeah, I don't I need the weapon, but I love how Riju is just waiting for me to figure this out. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we haven't seen Riju at all. We haven't even tried to fighting the fighting the boss. Like, uh, I didn't even get to the temple yet. I'm, I'm like, in the, the boss you fight, like, right before.
I believe I'm still wearing Zoro armor, right? Yeah, okay, so I think I could just swim up the... Leave till morning. Okay. So she's there, like... Okay. Okay, let's go do that. Well, I'm gonna, like, look around uh, from the skyline first. Because that was my first stop. Uh... Wellspring Island. Okay, I don't understand. They never explained this. Why is this place anti-gravity? You don't see any of the dragons. Not Zelda. Was the light dragon in the, uh, in Rest of the Wild? I don't think it was. Why did I let her get away from me? Ugh. Okay, it didn't work. Alright, let's... Morning. Should I set up a fire, or do I... Can I just go to bed? They should have used Zing. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm just like, wait, what the fuck? Okay. Yeah, it's a Dragon Quest jug. Okay. So Zelda just waits until, like, the end. All right. Yeah, she's not fast, so... I love how that thing didn't catch anything on fire. Okay. Uh, spiral, spiral, spiral. Alright. Okay. I don't see anything. Where the hell is she? The fuck is that? Uh, it's a skeleton, but it looks like a fucking monster hunter. <laughs> Look at that thing. It's like, what? Huh? Okay. Uh, alright, I guess we'll, like, just... Just keep, like, rotating around each of these towers and just jump. Like, trying to figure this out, because... Uh, yeah, how... Okay. Oh, I have that mark. Yeah, I don't think I'm doing shrines right now. I gotta, get, I gotta focus on getting this uh, light dragon ship. Yeah, where is she? <gasps> the central scion? Okay, uh, we'll, we'll try that.
how to find the light dragon. If you have progressed through the main story enough to obtain the quest Recovering the Hero Sword, your Pura Pads quest tracker will mark the Light Dragon's location on your map. Wait, hang on. Am I supposed to be doing this? Like, maybe I need to talk to Pura first. So I don't actually have the quest for this yet, so maybe I, I shouldn't be... Doing this quite yet? <laughs> oh no, shit, I thought that was it. That was just a marker. Fuck. Yeah, I don't see it. In order to pull the Master Sword out of its skull. Hey man, isn't it a girl? Aren't you misgendering her? Okay. Uh. The fuck is a Goron? What is this asshole doing? Oh, uh, so when you beat the thing, okay. Hey, where's Pearl? Okay. Yes. What is she talking about? <laughs> Why is she being such a bitch? Don't. Yep. Yep. Yeah, okay. Keep me put whatever. Shit. She's an obnoxious little shit. Okay. Uh Find Princess Zelda. I guess I'll just have to wander around until I see it, but... God damn it, what are you doing? Warp! They... <laughs> yeah, it was opening up the log instead of warping like I wanted. Like... <laughs> yeah, apparently... You get a quest for it eventually, and it gets marked in your map. That's probably what I should be doing, but... Okay.
Yeah, I need to be getting better weapons for uh, for that fight against the thing, and I just haven't done it yet. Shit. You had me at, like, better weapons, and I just... Ugh. I need the weapon now, because, like, I need something good to use. I guess we could try fighting it again. I don't even have, like, a, uh... A nearby shrine for Garuda found yet. <laughs> I've just been, like, going down there. Like, uh... Oh, I don't have any healing items, either. Like, the past couple times I've done this, I've just gotten wrecked in, like, a single hit. I desperately want the Master Sword, but... Yeah, if I see her again, I'll, I'll go for it, but I, I really need to focus on... Uh, this is so annoying, having to go through the... Go through the storm like this. Look, I have, like, two... Two weapons, too! Like, where are all the others? Like, why are they not just lying around like they are in the original? <sighs> All right. Why can't I just go up? Why am I stuck down here? Hang on. No, I, I haven't really... Like, typically what I was doing early on was, like, selling everything I could get. So I haven't actually messed around with using much at all. Yeah, I have plenty of strong monster parts, but, like, I just... Yeah. I haven't really done that much. Those have weapons? No, they don't. No, I don't think he does. Okay, we got a spear. Okay. Uh, okay, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try fusing. Hang on, it's. Where the fuck is it? I wanna say it was like this way? Okay, let's. Let's fuse before I forget. Okay. Uh, strong monster part. He knocks it? I guess we'll try that. A. Fuse. Uh, do a spear. Alright, let's see if that... At 12. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Okay. Yeah, I gotta do that more often, I suppose. I think Rudos have weapons lying around. If they do, I could just, like, make some more. 
There were a bunch when, like... I saw a bunch when I was, uh... When you had to do that, that defense mission. Which was actually pretty awesome, by the way. Ryuji's, like, thunder attack is so much fun to use. It's so satisfying. I, I wish, like... I wish there was, like, an entire mode of that. Of just, like, defending. Like, it was legit a lot of fun. Alright, uh... Why do they hate men so much? For some reason, Riju. Okay, find her to Zelda, Riju, Okuru. Okay. Hey, for some reason, Riju is, like, waiting for me in, like, the, the sandstorm. And not in town. Like, everyone else has, like, the entire region. Like, they'll, they'll dick around with you. But, like, for some reason, Riju is, like, very specific about <laughs> the fact she wants to stay here. And it, it, it makes sense, because I think, I, I would say out of everyone, like, Riju is the one who's, like, the closest oh. to getting fucked. Okay. Any food? Doesn't really work, does it? <laughs> yeah, we'll give the boss a shot. This thing is just waiting for me. Like, uh, what an asshole. Okay. One shot by this thing. I don't know what it is with these. Yeah, I need to like get better armor. Like I, I just, ugh. I haven't been able to find anything. Okay, uh, I think we're gonna go find better armor. I, I'm sick of this. Uh, great fairy. I'm sick of getting one-shotted. Well, 
I'll take more than rubies to unlock, unlike in Breath of the Wild. That's not true at all, you fucking retard. Uh... Okay. Yeah, I've been putting this off for a long time. Okay. The fuck? That's hilarious. Okay. Where's the ledger? Where do you check your... Pony points. Oh. Oh, wow, okay. Oh. Oh. But you're still missing two early game powers? What are you talking about? <laughs> what early game powers? Oh, it's a dog! Oh, look at the dog! Oh! 
Where's big man? Hey, weren't you a different color? I don't think... I'll have to, I'll have to look at my base game, because I think they might have fucked up. How does this work? You just, like... You actually get a... It's like Twilight Princess, only... Oh, whoops. It's like Twilight Princess, only you get to drive the cart this time. Aw, oh, man. Just like old Telmo used to. Why can't you move the horse? Okay. You can move the cart, but not the horse? Okay. All right, it's up the road. This is so cool. I've been waiting for this since Twilight Princess. Shit, this is like, this is Roots back in Madrid's mask. Yeah, I have like one empty spot. I still don't know what that is. Walk here, it's like five feet away! What? What with these lazy fu- What?! It was right there! We didn't have to go through dangerous territory or anything! Huh? What the fuck?! She's a violin girl. Okay. Is it weird of me to like musicians? All right. I have an apple. Yeah, I like the I like that fudge, but man, it is like really rich. Streaming for five hours? Are you serious? Didn't they start at like the the hour mark for for Tears of the Kingdom? Oh, hang on, sat on my controller. If this is anything like the Breath of the Wild, like I'm just gonna use this Freight Fairy over and over again, as opposed to any of the others. Ah, uh -huh. oh, no, why are they so hideous? What were they thinking with this design? Make Great Fairies hot, like. What is so hard about that? Wait, was that fucking Mario? Wait. Yeah, yeah. Was that fucking Charles Martinet? Her name's Violin? That's hilarious. Oh. 
Ah. Four long? Oh, come on. Aww. <laughs> the stable trotters. Oh, they better change this animation. Okay. I can't even upgrade them all that much. Well, at the very least, I can... Why can't I just give her rubies? Why do you need all these materials? Okay. They move like in between games. It's really weird. Okay, well. Well, I kind of have to mix and match a little bit, but I actually have more defense now, at least. At least I won't get one shotted. Probably should like. Raru Settlement Ruins. Wait, was this always... Huh? Is this, like, post-Calamity shit? Well, anyway. Yeah, I don't want to use my weapon, because... Okay, can I... 
Okay, what should I fuse with them? Let's see. Yeah, we got some Gibdo stuff. Maybe I should try that. Gibdo spawn. Okay, I'm gonna take this fusion hot. Forty four. Holy crap! That's way better than I thought of. Okay. Wow. Okay. Wow. That's a lot better than I was expecting. It probably won't last long because like I attached it to a fucking stick, but. That's actually really good. Okay, let's see. All right, we upgraded a little bit, so hopefully it'll be enough to let's let's cook a little bit for heals, and then no master sword. I want to see the dragon or my like, like I'm looking for it. Like, okay, I'm looking for the dragon. I swear. Ugh. not the dragon from Fire Emblem Awakening. The 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 multi thousand year old. Zelda, who looks like a grown woman. Uh, I don't know. Like the fact that you talk about like girls who are dragons, like everybody immediately just uh, uh, just assumes you mean like the stereotype. I'm a thousand years old, but I look like a twelve-year-old girl. What the fuck was that? Was that a reboot? Yeah. Okay. Like an angel. Can you cook bomb flowers? Like... I think Boko Blend stuff gets you some elixirs, right? If you mix it with Boko Blend bone. I I, I love this rendition of. Uh, Dragon Roost Island, by the way. It's gorgeous. Okay, let's throw it in there with some. Let's see if this works. Ah, damn. <laughs> Dubious? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Surprised he didn't get sick from that. Okay, uh. <sighs> yeah, monster parts look like they're way better than, like, fusing them onto weapons. Like, look at this. Like, I, I made a Gibdo bat, and it's, like, 44. Like, that's insane. Like, okay. Hinox Guts. Okay. Let's cook some bananas. Who the fuck cooks bananas? some meals okay i think we're just gonna go down there i'd like to get the master sword i would i'd like to get the master sword How do you get the...
Light Dragon is incredibly difficult to find in cash. For the most part, the Light Dragon takes a loop around the outer perimeter perimeter of Hyrule in a clockwise manner. The dragon loops around the Heber Mountains, flies eastward, then turns south to south. Okay. So, like, she's going around the... Ugh. Okay, fuck. The perimeter, okay. It's a massive dragon. It can't be too hard to find. I think it is. Uh, yeah, I think I think I should just wait until it updates. Ugh. I mean, I've only seen it once, right? Assuming it's like... Yeah, I think I'm gonna wait until the quest uh, triggers that I can use to... to track it down, because it seems like it's too much of a pain. I mean, it's not even... Not... I wouldn't know how to hunt it down if ugh, you didn't tell me, but... Uh, yeah, I think it's too early to do it now. Like, I can't find the fucking thing. I saw her by chance, yeah. Yeah, I think if you're gonna get it early, your best bet is probably just to get all the tears and then wait until like she appears in the cutscene. It's probably the easiest way to do it. David Jaff is coping hard, for sure, for sure. Is he still going wild? I don't understand why this guy, like, why is he complaining about Nintendo all the time? Like, what, what purpose does it serve? I mean, I guess Nintendo was rent-free in these people's heads, but... I can't believe I haven't recorded any videos in like a while. It's getting cold. Uh, fuck. Don't tell me I'm about to wear some. Uh, wait, no, it's not right. I'm so sick of having to make my way in the in the snow storm. Uh, in the sandstorm. I definitely want to, like, uh, get out from under those. Oh, wow. Okay, wow. I didn't even see that. Wow. Should I do the shrine now? I, I probably should. I didn't even see that the past several times I was down here. Wow. I was wondering where a shrine was. I didn't. I didn't notice that. I'd 
the Gerudo kids get up here? Because they're not that gigantic. Then <laughs> Riju's room. His name is Harmon Smith. All right. Uh. Fuck. Okay. Hopefully it's not a, too hard of a crime. Story of Tanag. How do they come up with these names? They sound nonsensical. No one understands how Nintendo made The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. It's going to take years to catch up to Nintendo. Yeah, other developers haven't even, like... The rest of the industry hasn't even caught up to Breath of the Wild yet. Like, I don't think people realize how big of a deal that is. Like, it's legit been, like, almost a decade. And, well, it's been half a decade. And nobody's made anything even remotely similar to Breath of the Wild. It's it's embarrassing. Uh, okay. What the fuck? Oh, it's like that, like, dungeon in... It's that dungeon in uh, Skyward Sword where you use the thing. Oh. <laughs> that game made by Jaff. Yeah, what is Jaff made of in God of War? Why is he talking about, like, Miyamoto's peak when he can't, like, handle... When he can't, hasn't made anything himself since, like, God of War? That, that's so weird to me. Like, he's objectively more washed up than, than anyone from Nintendo. Does. People keep linking me stuff on Discord, and I. The wonderful 101 remastered. They finally got the DLC out. Fucking really? After like what, like five years? What the fuck was that? What the fuck were they doing? <laughs> like, damn. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's use. Pretty based. Okay, uh, let's try something a little bit different with this. I'm gonna try Kinox materials. Horrible and horn. Uh, let's try that. All right, fusion. Ha! All right, plus eleven. That's uh, that's not bad. Fifteen. Final Fantasy 16 is just a hack and slash. It's shocking to me how many YouTubers are seriously, like, arguing that, like, Final Fantasy 16 might be a game of the year contender. It's not. Like, anybody who's, like, not a complete retard will tell you that. But, like, th there are, like, a shocking amount of YouTubers, like, trying to put forward the argument. And, like, a lot of people are, like, doing, like, the anti-woke angle. Because, like, you know, Final Fantasy 16... I... We really need to stop, like, thinking of wokeness as being, like having people of different races in it. Because I would say, like, Final Fantasy XVI has already proven itself to be woke. Because it was banned in Saudi Arabia because of, like, the... Uh... For reasons. We don't know exactly why. I think they had, like, a gay sex scene or something. I consider that woke. Let's, let's be real here. Like, Forspoken was woke. Like, who has any... Like, faith in Square Enix putting out anything good in 20, 2023? Like, it's just... Ugh. I don't know, hopefully, like, hopefully Final Fantasy 16 is, like, the last of it. And, and it does kind of seem that way. It feels like there's no real energy behind it. There was a lot of energy behind, like, Final Fantasy 16, 15, but, like, not so much with, with this one. I don't know, like, I... I'm a 
Final Fantasy fan. I love Final Fantasy, but it's just the series just has just fallen off for a long, has fallen off a long time ago, and nobody wants to admit it because it would mean admitting that Nintendo won. Hey, what is this light doing here? The Lightbringer. Oh no. Oh no, it's Lewis. I wonder if that song is on Spotify. Hey Alexa, play atop the fourth wall. Hey Alexa, play atop the fourth wall on Spotify. The fuck? Alexa, are you working? As far as I can tell, I'm working. What was if that? you're experiencing trouble, please give feedback through the Alexa app. What was that weird noise she was making? Like, it sounded like an error message. Hey, wait a minute. Alexa, stop. What the fuck was that? Was that an ASMR video? No, Alexa, stop. Alexa. Alexa! Stop. Alexa. Stop. What the hell? Fuck. That was, that was fucking weird. Oh, hang on. Uh... MGS3. I love they have, how they have to emphasize, like, MGS3, because nobody cares about, like, a remake of MGS2. Why would they remake 3 before 1? Like, if any Metal Gear game needs to be remade, I'd say it's the original. I mean, what I would do if I was given, like, control of the Metal Gear license, I would just make a Foxhound game. Like, that's what I would do, is just, like, give all those crazy characters from the first game, like, give them an actual backstory. Like, give them, like, actual fun missions to go on. And, like, just go nuts. Like, that's what I would have done if I was Kojima, and I wasn't a complete dipshit, but... Yeah, she has good taste in music. That was a that was a Donkey Kong soundtrack. I think she was playing an ASMR video at one point too. Before she started playing it, I, I don't know what the deal with that was. I don't know. I've been having problems with Alexa. Like I, I, I was wondering, like, when do you replace Alexa? She's almost like two years old. So I don't know if like I, I've been kind of having problems with her. I don't know if she needs like updated or like if I, I need to to update her or. How that works? Sony's gonna bring Konami back? No, it, it's just not gonna happen. Like Sony can't even bring itself. <laughs> and you expect them to save Konami? Like I don't know. Like I think I think Kojima. I think Sony made like the the move, the, the decision to like side with Kojima over Konami, and uh, that led to the situation of like Death Stranding and and stuff like that. That was like a bad move on their part, but. I mean, that's what they did. So I don't know if, like, Konami will will side with them or not. Like, Konami's actually been really... I would say, like, to be... This isn't me being, like, contrarian. Like, I legit think Konami might have gotten better, like, losing Kojima. Because, like, so much of the shit they were doing from, like, the, the 2000s was, like, his fault. Like, having, like, way too much influence at the company. And, like, you know, producing all these AAA games that were never going to make money. Like, you know... You know, in the past couple of years, they produced, like, uh, Super Bomberman R, which was fine. Like, eh, Konami is a shell of its former self, but a lot of that is because of Kojima. So I think it's possible we might actually see, like, a, a return to form to them. What is this light? Was that a mirror? I think it is. Bullshit. I think that's a mirror. Yeah, I think what you're supposed to do is like reflect the mirror. Remember when you used to have like a mirror shield that could do this for you instead of having to find, having to find like random things? Uh, 
By the way, Angry Joe has still not talked about this game at all. I've been paying attention to him. He hasn't done any, like, uh, reaction streams. He hasn't done, like, a first impressions video. He hasn't done shit. He's, like, sitting around trying to tell you, like, sell you on, like, shitty RTS games. Like, God, I'm so, I'm so fed up with, like, Angry Joe and his nonsense. I hope he, like, he seriously tries and comes out and, like, tries, like, saying this game isn't as good as Breath of the Wild. I hope he does. Because he's going to get called out so hard by that, for that. Oops. Yeah, I have no intention of this. I have no intention of ever playing the Silent Hill 2 remake. Like, I'm going to play the original. I'm going to play, like, Silent Hill 2 uh, HD on my Xbox One. And, uh, it's going to be shit, but, uh, <laughs> I'm going to play it anyway. Wait, where's the fan? What the fuck? What the hell? Wait. Am I supposed to twist the light so it comes through here? Like, the fuck? Yeah, I don't know why they're remaking 2 before the original. Like, that's what I would do, is just, like, remake all all four of the, the classics. I'm like, you know, they all have, like, overlapping elements anyway, so, like, just... I mean, I, I said this about, like, RE, the RE remakes as well. Like, why exactly are they doing them one at a time? Like, design them so, like, you have an overarching plot. And that, like, you know, actually give closure to those, to those titles. And then I would have, like... That's what I would have done, is, like, you know, make those... Make one... Make, uh, you know, the remakes of 2, 3, and 4, like, tie everything together. And then, like, you know, give the characters, like, an actual ending. Hey, this is nothing like the... That's weird. That was nothing like the, uh, how the mirror works. Because, like, in, in Wind Waker, you have to, like, pit face, like, the, the direction the light is pointing. Like, Wind Waker was actually better about that, because you can't, like, reflect light if it's not shining at you. Like, did you see that? How it was, like, flashing in different directions? Oh, this is the desert area, and they gave us a, a light puzzle. That's hilarious. Just like a spirit tumble. Is this, this is an Ocarina of Time reference? Okay, let's uh, let's go see if we can fight the thing. At the very least, we can just like fly down there. Yeah, when's the PlayStation Showcase? Does anyone know? She's just waiting for me to show up so she can fight the thing. Ah, whatever. Why is this so hot out? Why can't I... Do I have any heat resistance? I might. Cold weather attack? Yeah, it'd be, a, it'd be opposite of that. I love how you have, like, five guys with you. <laughs> like, you have four guys with you. It's like an RPG. It really is. Okay. <laughs> they 
beast. Okay. What? Does that mean it's like the other gifting? Our attacks should be effective now. Damn, why am I getting my ass kicked? Its attacks make no sense to me. But... Nothing but sand wherever we look. Where did it go? Damn, wait. Do we hit each other? Like, hang on. Oh, damn, he disappeared. Where the fuck did he go? Come here when it's not like so so light out. I died of the heat. What the fuck? That's so ridiculous. Yeah, I think I can definitely beat it. It's just uh Okay. Okay, let's go back. Okay, let's go. Wow, it's it's night and it's still pretty hot out.
that, bitch? What? Does that mean it's like the other gift then? That our attack should be effective now. <sighs> Nothing but sand wherever we look. Where did it go? Riju. Every single time I try... Got her. What the hell? It didn't go to a different phase. And I just hit a weak spot or something? Oh, come on. I thought it was... Okay. Porch, uh, let's light it. Reminds me of the beginning of the game with like the torch and Zelda and going through the tunnels. Oh, it feels like such a long time ago. This is the hardest, hardest temple in the game. It has to be, right? Definitely looks like it. The water temple was like really straightforward in comparison. It actually has traps. Oh man, it reminds me of Eternal Darkness. Oh, was that really a trap? Or... Ah, well. Just use Sidon. Have him use his bullshit power, and I'm good. Yeah, I was more concerned about that gate that was up there.
Did he? Uh, it is, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I think I'm ready to stop, honestly. I might, like, pick this up, like, um, later tonight, but I won't. I probably won't fire up the stream again. Uh, I think I might want to play something else for a bit. Where am I supposed to go? Seven floors of this shit? Well, they're pretty small areas, but... Damn! Seven floors? Yeah, a game like this, that's a lot. I'm kind of overwhelmed. I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, here we go. I don't think that's what I was supposed to be doing, but... Oh, Riju's not here. Uh... Yeah, like, the sh... Characters don't follow you in here, necessarily. Like, sometimes, like, the gate is closed off or something, and... You have to open the way for them. It's, like, it's weird. Ah, oh, here we go. Yeah, I don't think I want to beat this now. I think I want to take a break. Yeah, people talking like a lot about how like Hura looks better. Like Riju looks better for sure. I mean, I guess she's not like a little child anymore, but Daughter of the Garuda. This platform connects to the very top of this temple. Use your power to charge the four battles, and it will function once more. Heed my words. Weird. Why can't I just use Ascend? Uh, whatever. Like, yeah, okay. Riju, what are you doing? Get over here. Why is she not coming in? Alright. Alright. So this is one of the battles. It seems to have absorbed my lightning well enough. What is that accent? Okay. Uh, this is like... Okay. Okay, uh... Yeah, I think if I keep ascending, I could probably, like... It's such a weird claustrophobic dungeon. Like, every other dungeon gives you a lot of space to run around in, but... This one is just, like... Making you. This one just expects you to. Ugh. Okay, there's one. What is this weird lock? Ooh. Oops. Yeah, I think I'm ready to take a break. It's been like, what, four hours of this? Yeah, great game for sure, but 
Yeah, tomorrow night I'm going to try to play it again, and we're, we're going to try to get to the dragon. Super Nintendo, uh, Double May Cry, Pokemon, Ballas. Yeah, we're going to do Final Fantasy VI, weren't we? Pretty like six islands, I think. Yeah, I've been playing Final Fantasy I on my, on my spare time, and I'm enjoying it a lot, but... I've been uh, streaming Final Fantasy VI, and that's been that's been quite the experience in and of itself. Oh. I think I'm about ready to end the stream. I don't think I'll be able to keep this up for much longer. Uh, yeah, six hours isn't a bad stream. We'll 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 stream some more tomorrow. Did I even buy any shuriken for Shadow? I think I completely forgot. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter, but... I always love, like, the haunted music from this game. Uh, let's see. Throw. Blitz. Meteor Strike? Shadow was did it first. Right, whatever. Else in the news. Right. <sighs> oh no! Not the train. Oh, no. It's been a while since I played this game. I completely... I don't remember anything about what happens here. Uh... Sabin's always been my favorite character. Because the Blitz are... The Blitz is, uh... Blitzes are so much fun to use. What?
kind of love this game. It really is a classic. I'd like to get through this section, but I'm not sure I'll be able to. I, I legit feel like I gotta end the stream now. Ah. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, one of my big problems with this game growing up, um, you know, one of the reasons I didn't really care for it, I thought it was, like, way too easy. I think at the time, like, I was getting used to playing JRPGs. So, like, playing this for the first time, and, like, with the way it's structured and the way it's paced, like, you get through a good chunk of the story, like, fairly quickly. And it's not as long as a lot of modern games, so a lot of... At the time, I felt like it was kind of underwhelming. Of course, like, as an adult, I, uh, I have a more of an appreciation for it. Okay. Uh, probably should have used Sealed a little bit. Oh, damn, Shadow's fucking dead. That's like the only way to stop Shadow from like leaving, right? Is like have him be KO'd. I think I fucked up. I should have used a blitz. That's one of the reasons I always like prefer using blitzes because. to heal people. Yeah, I'll be talking about that at some point for sure. I mean, I've been saying this since Breath of the Wild came out, is that, like, the rest of the industry has nothing even close. beast. Oh, but their souls won't get to the afterlife. Oh, come on. Sabin, you douchebag. Okay. so many Final Fantasy games to get through, I really don't have any <laughs> interest in buying a whole lot else. Like, I gotta get through this, I gotta get through, like, five, like, four, like, just... Oof. Yeah, I'm not sure when I'm gonna have time to stream this, but... We'll get around to it eventually. I don't remember getting stoned that, like, that easily. Like, I've had it happen to me a couple of times, but, like, 
Usually they wait until you have like some reliable method of curing it before throwing it at you. Uh, antidote. Oh, I guess I could just use the tap. Do I have a tap? It doesn't look like I do. I can't bring myself to play this right now. Ah, should I play some RE4? I feel like so bad. There's so many games. So many games I want to finish. And I just have not done any of them. Like, uh... Yeah, I'm definitely anxious to get some, uh... Yeah, I think I'm ready to end the stream. I, I just don't feel as if I can keep this up for much longer. Leon, I've been able to get yeah, some I agree. info that might help you. Fill me in. in. Apparently, there's a religious cult group involved. They're called the Los Illuminados. Los Illuminados? That's a mouthful. Anyway, I had an unexpected run-in with the big cheese of this village. But you're okay, right? Yeah. But he could have killed me, but he let me live. And he mentioned something about me carrying the same blood as them. Whatever that means. Carry the same blood? Huh. Interesting. Anyway, there are more important things than solving riddles right now. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. I feel like you don't actually have to trigger this cutscene. Ada. With her actual voice. Bullshit, man. Damn it. I don't think I've ever backed away into this room before. I am completely out of... Why do they give me rifle bullets when I don't have a rifle? Ruby, excellent. Uh, all right, completely out of bullets again. Thank you. 
fix that. Oops, hang on. Knife versus knife. Here we go. Let's go, bitch. Bring it on, bitch. Oh, here we go. Name's Leon S. Kennedy. Oh man, I love this game. Oh. Un forastero! Yeah, I just love like tearing through them. Oh, so cool. Okay. Oh damn, that was a, a long distance. Blasting Ganados never never gets old. Do any damage for some reason. Did they not do damage if they hit you from behind? Okay. Uh... Oh, that was that was lucky. Uh... Okay. You don't hear the Spanish line, uh, the female lines very often. Probably because there aren't that many female villagers, but. Go back. So weird playing like uh, Operation Eight, uh, separate ways, and like having these situations, having these like safe areas being infested with monsters. I love this game. I really do. It's been so long since I played a uh, separate ways. I really, I really need to take the time to do it. So I might do it like next time, uh, this time. You got something that might interest you. I love how I was dead tired playing Final Fantasy VI, but woke up. A selection of good things. What yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing. I don't know. Maybe it's different in this version of the game. Maybe I should like do it. Eh. Thank you. 
Is that all? <laughs> what are you see. buying? Rifle, rocket launcher, stock. We'll wait until like he gets a better. Is that all? <laughs> Scope Thanks. rifle. Is that all? Eh. What are you buying? Is that all? <laughs> is it? Is it? <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? I hate how he doesn't have like the best stuff like right away. Uh, okay. Combine. TMP. We're good. Does it does it does feel like it handles differently? Maybe it's like a Wii version thing that like it doesn't really do anything on the on the Wii version. Like having the stock. Oh man, look at that impact! Oh, so satisfying. Leon, the door's locked. I can't get in. Didn't they teach you how to pick locks at the academy? <laughs> they taught all those lessons to Jill. Like something might fit inside. Well, there's no use standing around. Leon, you have to find some way or something to get inside. Uh, actually, I think it's Z if I... How many hours have I put in Tears of the Kingdom? I don't think it's told me yet. Hang on, let me look. Seven days ago. Yeah, it's not telling me yet. It doesn't... It doesn't do that very much, honestly. It's, it's weird. Like, it takes like a week before it starts. Oh, here we go. I love how we were, how we were already uh, completely forgotten about the re remake. By the way, <laughs> that's funny. Get Ashley until chapter two. 
That is weird to think about. Here, El Gigante. Okay. I was expecting a face button, not the shoulders. Oh, yeah, no. I did. Oh. It's old. Okay. Uh, yeah, I really gotta play separate ways. I don't know why I've uh, I've been back to do it for so long. I mean, I I played it before, but like I think I've only done it once, or maybe a handful of times. I don't know. The base game is so good. I just don't. Austin. It's weird to think that you fight Del Lago so early on. cops like do anything in the remake <laughs> if any characters needed to be fleshed out more it's those guys those guys didn't even make it past chapter one one like it's a joke like how are you that incompetent like ada survives fucking lewis survives multiple chapters like ashley survives in the end like those guys are like i, I don't know like <laughs> Oh, man, they're used, they're red shirts. They really are. I never 
never watched. I didn't watch classic Star Trek because I've never actually seen like a red shirt happen. Like I've never actually seen that. Like I, I don't know this. I know the stereotype, but like I, I don't actually like know it. You know what I mean? Like I'm familiar with it, but. I love Del Lago as a boss. Like I've always loved the design. I've always loved like the setup. I've always loved like the, the thing. Like this is actually one of the things that really made me want to play the game was seeing this. I actually like. Um, there's actually a se sequence in Clover Part Four uh, that's heavily influenced by this. You'll. You'll, uh, you'll see it. You'll know it when you see it. I don't know why it, like... I don't know why the, the chain always just constantly reattaches itself. It's such... It's like peak video game logic. Alright, here we go. Oh, he's gone. Spooky, spooky. Oh, here he goes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. This is different than the Wii version, I think. I haven't struggled with this boss in a while. Oh, the Jaws camera. You can tell how, like, quickly Leon's trying to get out of the water. Oh, oh fuck, again? That was weird. I don't usually struggle with this boss, but I, I guess it's like slightly different in this version of the game. Here he comes. Oh wow, okay. I feel like I didn't hit him a lot. Oh no, Leon, no. How was that thing not even attached to the boat? Hacking at it would work. I I I do it like that.
game never gets old. It really doesn't. Oh, hang on, what? So I have this complete f***ing stalker. Um, but he knows he can't talk to me, because if he does... Uh, I told him, I said, you, you talk to me again, I'll get a restraining order against you. And it won't be hard, because you already have several, and I have reason to believe that you're dangerous, and also a fucking lunatic, and also stupid. Uh, Whenever Nick starts talking, running his mouth about this kind of thing, I automatically don't believe him, because he said the same thing about, like, Monograph, right? And what happened? Like, he's getting wrecked. So we have this dog. Is he emails like 20 people every time I say something about the Monty lawsuit? Pretty much, um, this trying to report me for allegedly live streaming while driving. Okay, homie. I mean, I need to play Goldeneye again. It's been a while. The police are going to uh, run to arrest me immediately and throw me in prison forever. with your life, you fucking weirdo. Yeah. If I ever see you anywhere near me or my family, I will not hesitate to act in self-defense because you are <laughs> Wait, is that a threat? Is that a threat? Oh, wow. If a person's name, they will ejaculate. All, they will ejaculate so hard that Wisconsin will be blood. Not high yeah. Very No, this is some, this is some really dedicated yeah. fucking thing. But no, I won't say their name. Hell yeah, bro. Place no monkey business. Surprised his badge was called this. Explain all the missing 
I love this song. Ha! I had you executed! He really is like the voice of Carol. <laughs> I cannot hear it! And proudly we stand. I am Kremli. I am King. All the thunder as you buy, but in thunder. So bear the witness to our redemption, and the full of you to choose. We will take back what is right for the hours. <laughs> That's so fucking cool. That's so insanely good, I love that. Like, I'm obsessed with K. Rool right now because of that song. Okay. Like, I hope that team, like, continues making good stuff. Like, I, I hope we have, like, a renaissance of, like, multimedia Nintendo properties. Like, I would love, like, cartoons and anime and, like, films. I mean, I, I guess we're in the early stages of the film thing. But... Oops, I probably shouldn't have come down here so soon. Hi, I'm Edelgun. Okay, here we go. Say I wanted to play Metroid Fusion specifically, and here I am, like, not playing Metroid Fusion. Every time I play this game, I just can't stop. Uh, yeah, I, was, I wanted to play Ocarina. There's so much stuff. Yeah, Final Fantasy VI. Ugh. Valus? Yeah, I'd love to play Valus. Uh, Game Boy. It's been a while since I played Game Boy Advance. Ace Attorney? Oh, man. Battle Network? Yeah, there's so much great stuff. Uh, yeah, I, I, I've made the right decision, I think, to, like, cut back on my game purchases, because there's so much. So much I haven't beaten yet. Honestly, like, I think I might have to, like, just end the stream, like, very soon. Ugh, yeah, seven straight hours of gaming. I should, like, uh, get to work on the next book. Which, uh, by the way, I think is going to come out much sooner than anyone is expecting. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm getting towards the end. It's weird. Like, tomorrow we'll try to finish this, for sure. Honestly, I think I'd rather play Dread again rather than this. But, uh, yeah, next time. Once I get caught up on everything else. Hey, 
Let's see him. Metroid 2. There's nothing here. Right, let's go back. This isn't the first time I've been stuck here. <laughs> like, this has happened before. Exactly like Super. Oh no! Oh, I'm stuck. go anywhere like uh, why am I caged in right. uh, Yeah, I don't think going back is necessary. stuck here like <laughs> the last time I played this too it's like yeah, this is typical for me like I'm just locked in here. Heaven's gates won't open up to me. Alright, here we go. Thank you. 
Oh, here we go. Terry has such a weird off the rails feel to it. Like, you always feel like you have no idea what you're doing. Okay. Hey, didn't I, like, play this, like, not all that long ago? I had to kill them all. To open the door, but okay. Yes, that's my least favorite part of the game. I just don't like like claustrophobic feel to it. Like getting getting stuck. It's just not a fun area. Like every time I play this, I'm just like Ugh. this part again. I guess this is like my Metroid Fusion equivalent of like Poison Pond or whatever. Okay. Oh, wow. Not one open. Weird. It's so confusing. Uh, yeah, I remember now. Uh, Thank you. 
bear the witness. Be alone. Alright. Oh. Ah, that confuses me so much. Security four. Yeah, we're almost at the end of the game for sure. That's like the roughest part of the game, I would say. I'd say like the rough parts are all over. Yeah, I think I'm gonna save it and then call it quits again. It's not our stream. It's not bad. I'll, I'll I'll come back tomorrow and stream again. Just save up here. No reason not to. Alright. Thanks everyone for tuning into the Black Hat Show. Be sure to check out my books at blackhatbooks.org. And I will see you all next time. Thank you.